Yeah! Alright, uh, hey, hey, hello, I'm here. D d don't ignore me fiddling with my stream deck settings. Hey, Jess. Yes, the title screen song is very much, as you would say, uh, sex. I don't know what that is. Is that a food? Like a fruit or something? Um, hey, I'm here, and I'm- it's early. It's 10.30, as opposed to 12 a.m. <laughs> so, we're gonna do, uh, Star Force tonight, and we're doing it early, because I might be able to finish... Dude, that's some good-looking food. Yummy. Is that salsa? Mmm. Good stuff. Mega Man Star Force, we're up to close to the end of the main story. Don't know if I'll... I'll probably finish that tonight. Don't know how much of the post game will do. The post game is not super long in this game, but it does, um... It does require grinding to finish, like most Mega Man games. So, we'll do what we can, and, uh, I might take a break from this for, like, one day or so just to get the chips I need. And then, um... We'll return and finish it up in like one more stream. So I think there's probably only gonna be one more stream after this, uh, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, we are at the end, close to the end of the game. We, we we're at the point where we're starting to see uh, the the end game revelations pop in. Em King has made up made his way here. some new chips, cards, or whatever, first and foremost. I don't have Blazing Edge yet. Well, yes, I do. I have Star Blazing Edge. That does count. I think. <clears throat> yeah, I thought about it, and I'm actually doing really good on card collection in this, uh, in this game. I've got, like, pretty much everyone I could get up to this point. Some of them are, you know, star only, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, yeah, I have Blazing Edge Star, so that does count. I have five giga chips, so I, I did. I did clarify this uh, last night. You do get the GX chip automatically over the course of the game, but you only get the one for your satellite. Getting all three is a, is um is very much a patch thing. So normally by this point I would have three of these instead of five. In fact, actually not even three because Darkness Hole Star Frags and those aren't in the original game. So I would only have one at this point or two at most. Possibly only one, because I believe the prices were rebalanced for, to make things easier to buy. So we got that covered. Yeah, I think we're pretty much good in terms of cards, in terms of, like, individual card collection right now. Unless I wanted to go and grind the, uh, the bosses for SP and EX cards, which I don't want to do. I'm gonna be working on assignments, so at least I have your cute, cute borb on your screen. <laughs> Thank you. It's not much of a secret, but I've been... Trying to get in the talks about having a, a, a VTuber Borb. I don't know how that would work or look, but eh, we'll see. She's never been this cold to us before. She won't talk to us either. Something pretty bad must have happened to her. So we have to apologize to Luna. We broke our brother bands with her and Sonya. Sonya we made up with at the end of the last stream. Uh, and I also did the Lunar Nights side quest last stream. And, uh, it gives you no reward for doing it. You just get a couple cutscenes. Though now, um, apparently, uh, those extra battle cards that they added to this version of the game, which are actually in the Japanese version, uh, will start showing up now in gold mystery data. So I kind of have to keep my eye out whenever I see one spawn. Which should have a much higher rate than the, uh, original game. I think it was, like, 1 in 16. Now it's a 1 in 2 shot. <coughs> uh, um... Try not to hit speed up too much tonight. 
It's mostly just when I'm backtracking, I do that. I don't like doing it, uh... Normally. Luna. Um... Bud, Zack, can you please give us some space? Okay. Sure. Bud, want to hang out at my place? Oh, sure. Trying not to give him, like, the Dex voice, but, like, while still keeping it the same. But it's very much these Dex, let's be honest. Luna, I... I'm sorry. A lot of things happened and I thought about it again. Um, so if it's okay with you, can we be brothers again? You have a lot of nerve. Do you have any idea what you did? It's not something I could forgive just like that. Ah! An earthquake. It can't be. Oh yeah, so, uh, the space station that Geo's dad was on is starting to, uh, hurtle towards Earth. And, uh, the planet's getting covered with Z-waves, which is allowing people to see the wave world now. And also, uh, potentially turn people into masses of Z-waves that will be fed to this Andromeda being. What is all this? Looks like we got another wave ball. No! Stop! Bud? Zack? Bud, Zack, Manek goes Crickle Crack. I'm still dropping some frames, but not as many as yesterday. Bud, Zack! Oh, how'd they get up there? <laughs> oh, goody, more humans! Oh, let us go! Get your hands off of me! Help, please! Gotta do something. <laughs> Yummy snacks for Andromeda. That girl looks especially tasty. How, how did you do that? Luna! Geo! Now, now, wait your turn. We'll turn you into waves after these three. I'm not waiting for you. I won't run away anymore. I'm gonna fight to protect those I care about. I'm gonna protect everyone I can. Don't be a dork, you can't fight them. Run! Find an adult and get help. You're a good talker, but just how are you gonna protect them? Hmm? EM wave change. Geo Stellar. On the air. That was not the voice I should have given Geo. You! You're the one that defeated the FM Warriors! Mega Man? You! No way! Geo is Mega Man? Tch, this isn't good. Here's a lovely parting gift! Denied. Oh no you don't! Curses! Wait you! Was picking on his Mega Man. You weren't really picking on him. You were just trying to convince him to come to school. Mega Man. He did that like George Lucas approaching J.J. Abrams movement right there. Which I've used that joke on stream before. I've showed it off during Danganronpa. Persistent little bugger, isn't he? Let's move! They go over here. Gotcha. You're not getting away that easily. Now, gotta let your guard down, boy. Now eat roof. Ah. Three jammers, three jammer threes, three jammers three threes. Oh my god, that's 800 health each. That's a lot of damage. Oh shit, I'm already in Pegasus form too. God damn it, I don't want to be in Pegasus form. 
I upgraded my data. And I guess it automatically reactivates it. It just takes so long to charge, I don't like it. doesn't show up in the front row. Alright, that was completely pointless. God, this style is awful. I hate Pegasus style. This charge shot is awful. It takes forever to it takes forever to charge. It's not good. Gemini Spark works. So they show up on the oh, they show up on two different rows. Oh, but well, they both attack the same target. Okay. Deactivate that immediately. Wow, busting level of one. Awful. Ah! Phew. We're not out of the fire yet. We still have to take care of the wave ball. Over there! Hang on, okay? I'll get you down in a sec. Ba -bum. Mega! Got it! Mega Buster! Better not use that uh, Pegasus charge shot. That thing sucks. Alright. We good. Is everyone okay? Yeah. Oh wow, I never thought that you were Mega Man. Hey Ephraim, how you doing? Why didn't you tell us? I, I, I'm sorry. You were the one who saved me when I went nuts. And it was you again at Amakin, and that time at school too. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for treating you like dirt. Mega Man has always been our idol. To think that he was you, Geo. Someone we see every day. I, I feel honored. <laughs> Oh, uh, what are you waiting for? Hold out your transfer already. <laughs> I guess I could let you be my brother again, but just this once, okay? My link ability is that. Yeah, yeah, we've already read this. Luna. Consider it a thank you for saving us. Next time I won't be so forgiving. Bud, Zack, let's go. Okay. Yes, madam. 
Can I get them as, as brothers now? Um, Geo, please be my brother. Huh? I know it might seem strange because I've done nothing but pick on you till now, but I've always really looked up to Mega Man. I really want to be like him. I'm really sorry for everything, so please be brothers with me. Hey, Ryoko, how you doing? Please? Um, sure, I'd be happy to be brothers. Really? I'm gonna learn how to be a good guy from you. But Bison is now your brother. Nice, and I got the Leo satellite. Yo, Geo, what's up? My link ability is super armor. It's tough under any attack. Cool, huh? Forget dodging. Just go in hard and kick some alien butt. Go get him. Um, I want to be brothers with you too, but I don't really think I could personally handle it right now. But one day... What are you two doing back there? Well, see ya. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. That's a promise from one man to another. Goodbye. Sweet deal. More power. A promise from one man to another. Hey, don't you have time? You don't have time to lollygag. You still have a few more FMians left to mop up. But how are we supposed to find them? I bet they're on your dad's space station. If only we could find some way to get there. Get there, but they're in outer space. How are we supposed to even get into space? <laughs> I bet that Boreal guy would know. Ah, good idea. Cool. My number of friends has increased. I went and became brothers with him again. But if he ever cuts our brother again, Ben again, that's it. We're through. Sometimes I act... Okay, yeah. It's, it's all, all, all old stuff. I can't believe he was Mega Man all this time. And I wanted to be just like him, too. I need a burrito just to take my mind off of it. I'm tough on the inside, on the outside, but actually I'm insecure, and I just want to fit in. If Prez got our brother banned, I'm afraid I'll go back to being a nobody. Where's your public bat? Yeah. Taylor Ham, not pork roll. Alright, uh. We already looked at brother. Mega. Alright, oh, I actually. Hold on. Yeah, as much as I want to keep that on, I don't like having starting in Pegasus mode. I wish there was a way to just disable that specifically. Getting two attack is pretty good, though. That pretty much. That means if I equip the power ring, I have 5 3 3. But again, I just. That charged shot for, for the Pegasus is just not good. I get the point of Brother Brand, I feel there's some real bad implications of it. You mean not everyone refers to as a brother regardless of gender? I think it's more the security concern. It's essentially, um, it's essentially like Facebook on crack. But I mean, the whole point is that, at least in this game, Brother Band is supposed to be a very limited thing. You're only allowed to have six of them. Later games change that immensely, because they make it so that you can have unlimited in-game brothers, and then six real-life brothers. It's very interesting, too, because, like, these take up Wi-Fi slots. Like, you don't get a whole friends list, like in other DS games. Your friend list in this game is limited to just your brothers. So they do, in that regard, feel a lot more personal. The later games kind of make it a lot less personal as a result. Personal. By, uh... By, uh... Eliminating it. They make it a lot less... Personal. ...about it. Uh, anyway. Uh, okay, so we gotta we gotta go see Mr. Boreal again. Library, yeah. Library. On air. I don't know why there's two different options for these. They could have squeezed that into one menu or whatever. There's a lot more voice clips as the series goes on. The third game, whenever you pick up a piece of uh, mystery data. Uh, it, it goes, data acquired. 
Especially as annoying as the only good brother ability from other players is the Pegasus ability. I actually don't know what the Pegasus ability is. <laughs> Increases custom gauge speed, ah. Okay, uh, so we gotta go see, uh, Mr. Boreal. Mr. Oreo. I'm guessing I didn't miss anything in terms of, like, side quests or anything at this point. I'm pretty sure I've done all, if not most of them. Dragon gives Mega plus one, Leo gives Attack plus one. Well, there you go, Dragon's already ahead of the game. Honestly, Mega plus one. Attack plus one is such a awful a buff. Because you can get an attack plus one any other any other number of ways. Custom gauge you can only speed up with the with the card that's in this version of the game. Alright, no one here. I think I've done all the quests. I know there's quests for the main characters, but they don't pop up until the end of the game. Also, I just realized I don't have Ground Wave 3, so I better start fighting the next set of Mets I find. <clears throat> so I bought... Once again, I ordered something from Amazon Sunday afternoon before coming home from my girlfriend's house. And, uh, it was already here today. By, like, 2 p.m. Uh, I got another two Digimon, because I'm, I have a problem. Uh, I have now completed my version 20th collection. I have one of every, uh, variation of the programming. A, B, C, D, and E. Um, I got a new box of Jack Links because I'm running down to three, so now I'm up to 23. I usually get one every two months, but even that's a little too often. I try not to go to a whole box in two months. Uh, and then I also ordered, because I'm going to a fair in a couple months, not a couple months, two weeks, and, uh, there's no seating at it. Uh, my girlfriend has this, like, pop-out stool, and I bought one for myself, and it's really neat. I love it. Like, you, like, twist it, and then the whole thing pops up, and it can support a person of 400 pounds, so it could just barely support me. What'd you order if they already had it ready for your dorm one afternoon? Just those things. Whenever I order something that ships from Amazon directly, even if I choose free shipping and wait, and, like, it says, like, it, com it comes in five days, it gets here in one, because wherever the closest warehouse is is like 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 miles away from here the last like two or three times I've ordered from them it's been here in like a day that world that was like on the ceiling I feel like I've seen it before probably under promising maybe but I mean it's still ridiculous that it gets here that quickly I must be, like, where... I, I live close to where it gets loaded up. I feel dizzy. Got an order for side that is not two days past. The UPS says you're getting it by tomorrow night. I mean, that's the other thing. Amazon uses their own delivery system, so that's why it's quicker. Also, hey, Selene. And that the waves a hundred times their usual strength are coming from inside here. What's going on around here? Don't worry though, like other stuff I order takes forever to get here. I have another item from that order that I put in, and it's not gonna be here until next week. Because it's shipped separately. Sai like the weapon. I've seen it. I've seen it on her Amazon wish list. <laughs> like the little, the little knife, the little, the little Ninja Turtle knives. What's up, Geo? I, I keep forgetting the voice I give him. Um, is there any way we could transmit something from here up to the space station? Hmm. Honestly, I think it would be very hard 
could be anywhere in space. Looking for it is like trying to catch that one special fish in that endless sea of the void. Weird analogy. Oh. But we should at least give it a try. Hmm. What is it? I think there might be a way. Really? I think you know, but after that incident, a section of Kelvin Station fell to Earth. If we could fix the transmitter in that section, we might be able to contact the space station. Where is that section right now? I'm sorry, but the person who would know that no longer works at NASA. What? There was only one person who knew. He was our boss at the time, and he was the person ultimately responsible for creating a brother band between Earth and Planet FM. After the incident, he was in charge of the search, but one day, he suddenly left NASA, taking everything he knew about it with him. No one has heard from him again, but I heard a rumor that he has been spotted in the vicinity. But well, you don't need to go through so much trouble. I'm sure NASA knows something, too. They must have caught the signal from the space station as well, and they have some very powerful EF we EF EM weapons. Oops, don't tell anyone I told you that. EM weapons? Andromeda would just eat them up! Mr. Boyle, please tell me about your old boss. So originally, this this dialogue was not as descriptive, apparently. But, uh, he does drop a hint in, in this patch where he is. I mean the details, octagon, octagonal, round, chrome, black, uh. I know it's Sire. <laughs> See that guy, and you just hear John Tron screaming Aaron's name. One FME and later in the game is based on the constellation Corona Borealis. Really? What are you going to do? I want to do something to help. <laughs> okay. I haven't seen him in a while, but he was a refined old man. An old man, huh? Thanks, Mr. Boreal. Geo, I told you a lot about the incident because of what's happening. But let's not worry your mom too much, okay? I understand. So now we're looking for Mr. Boreal's old boss. All we know is that he's an old man. Sheesh, not much of a description to go on, is it? Hmm. Mail? It's from Leo Kingdom. Geo and Omega says a great calamity is upon all of this planet. As you have formed a brother band on the Leo satellite, I can now grant you a fragment of my power. This will surely help you in the battles to come. Come to the Amakin rooftop wave road once you are prepared. What do you think? Should we do that first? Right now, we have no clue where that old man is. And if we're going up against Andromeda, we're gonna need all the help we can get. I say we go check this out first. Right. Let's go pulse in, then. Something tells me that this time they won't go easy on us. Better make sure we're ready. So again, you don't usually fight all three of them. That's a patch exclusive thing. You just usually fight the one your version's based off of. Relax, Leo's lame. To be fair, dra dra as much as Dragon is my favorite one, the fight with him is was absolute cake. Because his movement is so slow, it's so easy to hit him. It's interesting that they work these in as a required part of the game, though. They really put the they really put the time in making this patch uh, flow seamlessly. I want to set check since I'm here. If you do quad damage to wood bosses, maybe even more. True. No mystery data at all, huh? Okay. Pretty sure I've already bought everything from that navy. Those are navvies, right? Like, these are... Because the trucks are considered navvies. Yeah, I have all these already. Okay. I think I've cleared out every shop at this point in terms of unique chips. Aside from the uh, aside from the Starfrag trader, they're called navvies multiple times. Yes, got it. It's weird because like they're navvies, and then the third game renames the EM beings wizards for some reason. Terminology in these in these games aren't always set in stone. Remember viruses busting from Battle Network 4? I 
got assigned to this area recently. Hope I can be as good as the last guy. So curious what happens if the Gigabomb card goes off on Ophiuka Frozen sitting on grass. What the hell? What the? What's this wave ball doing here? It's connected to another dimension. A voice echoes from inside the wave ball. Hello. Okay, I'm connected. Hello. Oh, it's Lucian. I'm Lucian. I crossed over from another dimension to get here. Let's be brothers. Should I? That's very... That is way too cheery for Lucian. There he is. The Lunar Knight himself. I'm connecting from the world of Lunar Knights. Why don't we help each other out? My mouth doesn't move, even though I have a movable portrait in this game. When you find something that you think might be useful to me, send me a mail. In return, I'll send you rare things i found. I've got a few battle cards that you can't find in your world. And if you know any tips for Lunar Knights, let me know as well. I could use some help. By the way, there are other portals like this one. Why don't you try forming some more brother bands with Lunar Knights? Good things might happen if you do. May the sun be with you. That is not something he would say. Looks like that's a mail. It looks like you... Is that supposed to be... Is that supposed to be the, uh, the Otacon scientist? It looks like you've made a friend from the world of Lunar Knights. With this, you'll be able to use the Terennial's power, too. Now that our worlds have been connected, you may find special battle cards as well as subcard items in Mystery Waves. These subcard items cannot be used by yourself, but perhaps they may be of some use to your brother. When you find such an item, you should try sending a mail to your brother. As the ties between our worlds grow even more numerous, these special items may appear more frequently, too. Moreover, have you played Lunar Knights yourself? If you have, tell your brother the secret password. You might just be glad you did. In the world of Lunar Knights, the Tyrannals are forced to be reckoned with. Use their powers wisely. It's complete! Okay, I've hacked it in! Uh, I do technically have that code, I believe. Don't send present. Uh, I don't know what to write for this. write anything. Alright, give me one second, I'll look it up. Lunar Knights, Michael McCaw. Okay, finale. Probably earlier than that. Oh. I wonder if this works with the English version. There it is, I saw it. Where is it? Oh, don't full screen. Please, five seconds of rewinding and you're gonna buffer. Come on, bro, come on, bro, come on, bro. Oh my god, YouTube, are you serious right now? YouTube, absolutely wildin'. Really? Really? What is this? Why is it so hard to get this code? There it is. Alright. Pull out the actual emulator screen. Oh, that's gonna look weird. Uh, no, that's not gonna work. Okay. Shit. I'm gonna pop out. Mini player. There we go. Capturing okay? Okay, yeah. Alright, my code was... Y... 1... L... Y... G... 
U for F B A. Wait, how am I gonna fit this? This is four lines. This is four lines long. Do I just put it in with no spaces? Equals M three S lowercase A seven B E four R Henro A V C P B I think I have just enough here. C N F C lowercase v two G O N B uh one two three one two three four five one two three four five six seven 21, 21 plus 4 is 25. 5, 10, 15, 20, wait, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. Did I miss something here? 5, 10, 15, 20. There should be 40 letters. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 times 3. 28, 20 plus 14 is 42. Okay, yeah. Alright, that's the right amount. Wow. I, uh, I am, I am math. I am math right now. Yep, that's 40. Alright, I guess that's it. Send it. Hey, Geo, you play Lunar Knights too? So you've beaten Lunar Knights on normal mode. Not bad, but can you handle hard mode? I feel inspired by your efforts. Lucian's level has increased level 30. He was 1 before. I think you'll be able to make good use of this. See you. Mega Man got Dark Folder. Looks like I got some mail. Alright, it worked. It worked. Okay, look. This might be kind of overdue, but better late than never, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and explain Extra Folders. No doubt you've seen the Extra Folder in the Battle Card screen before. It's a special folder that can't be edited. You can swap between any Extra Folders you found with a Change option. Collecting cards is such a pain, you know? So with any extra folder, you can easily try out new strategies. Oh, and here's a hot tip from yours truly. Whenever you obtain an extra folder, all of its cards are registered in your data library. Might be a good way to get info on cards you couldn't get otherwise. Yeah, the extra folder in this game does not uh, come up very often, huh? Dark folder. This is Radar Missile 3. Uh, Poison Knuckle. Break Saber, Ghost Pulse 2, Purple Ink. I don't think I had Purple Ink. Berserk Sword 3 I definitely didn't have. Darkness Swords I didn't have. Ezra, Ezra V2. Alexander, Alexander V2, Alexander V3. Gemini Spark EX. Nice. Cool, 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 cool. So that's in my library now, huh? Would have loved to have got that yourself. Right, check it out. Gemini Spark EX is here. Radar Missile 3. Well, I have Radar Missile 3 already. Uh, purple Ink I didn't have. If hits enemy adjacent panels, turn to poison. Mop Lance, Vulcan Seed, Brave Sword, Zinc Hook, Bigot, Berserk Sword 3. I don't even have Berserk Swords 1 and 2. Ice Burst? Where the hell is that move? Attacks using ice panels on field. That's actually better. Typhoon Dance, we already had that. Jam Machine Gun. Darkness Sword. Lunar Knights cuts row in front and side. 110, 150, and 190 damage. Do you get additional extra folders in vanilla? I actually don't know. Alexander, Terennial, Tornado from Nearest Enemy. They don't- the Terennials aren't actually summoned into the game, they just do effects that resemble the Terennials. Oh, it's a star version, too. 
Paralyze HP, Bug, and Blind. Ezra, Terrenial 3 Icicles, Freeze Enemies. Plus 30 Attack and Enemy Panel on Ice. And Slow Gauge and Fast Gauge at the bottom. Cool. 109 chips now, not bad. Link ability HP plus 80, charge plus 1. Cleared normal mode, try hard mode. I mean, if I enter my... I've beaten hard mode in the DS version. If I get the code from that, I could upgrade Gushin even further. 822, 2922. Beat Dumas, but... Got through new Kaliakin. Next, the Dark Castle. Purified Stoker met Ezra. Save the injured K at the station. Purified the Pose and met Tove and Co. Beat the Gold Chimera at the Solar Gun Knight. Purified Rhymer and met Ursula. Beat the Ant Lion to the mansion. This is just the major story beats from that game. I'm a vampire hunter. The name's Lucian. Hope Ezra's good in Lunar Knights. I pray for Ezra on every roulette. <laughs> Ezra and Lunar Knights? Well, here's the thing. The Terrenials and Lunar Knights just give you elemental power to your uh, weapon. So it just gives you ice power. Um, and if you blow into the microphone, they do, they do an effect. I don't know what Ezra's is, but all of them were pretty good. Uh, and then they all had their ultimate attacks, which were useful in certain situations, depending on what the enemies uh, were. Anyway, he does not have a server, so... Do I actually get a card in my folder from him? Yeah, I do. I wonder what his favorites are, because it doesn't show up. He doesn't actually have a favorites list here. I know if you do everything in this version, you could get a, um, a brother band with Legendary Master Shin as well. But I do not, uh, I do not anticipate doing that. Oh my god, am I still dropping frames? Really? I, I was hoping the frame dropping would have been, like, a last night thing. It's not terrible, but it's not, it's noticeable. strides a human can make in the briefest of moments. Even though it has only been a little while, you have not just regained your old strength, you have surpassed it. Very good, Geo. I commend you, and Omegasus as well. I've come to realize it's up to myself to protect those I hold dear. I always saw relationships as things that only weigh you down, but I get it now. This power, my power, it's all thanks to the bonds I made with my friends. Indeed, this is a power that the FM King does not know, and it is the key that may lead you to victory. But you didn't invite us over to congratulate us. You called us out here for a fight, am I wrong? Very perceptive, Omegasus. Yes, I want to see your growth firsthand. If you are able to defeat me, then I will lend you my powers. Prepare yourself, Mega Man. Scoot right up to you. Look alive, Geo, here he comes! Wave battle. Ride on! Okay, so I got my instant kill on him. Ready to go. Damn it! That last radar missile was right there the whole time. Whoa! Gregar lives, yeah. That's literally his attack pattern. I was gonna say, if I get another Taurus Fire and then I just have three of them, that would have been pretty amusing. Okay, we just 
just instant kill him now. That was almost unnecessary since he was already down to like a hundred health, but it was still it's still amusing. Not bad. That's a busting level of ten. He was a complete pushover. Excellent. This is the kind of power that could save this planet. It seems you are ready. All doubts have been cleared from my mind. Receive this geo, my star force. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm gay. Now you will be able to use the Leo Star Force. It will grant you fierce power. Power to protect everything you hold dear. Leo Kingdom, thank you. The past is the past, but it need not be the Earth's future. Show the FM King the power of relationships trumps the power of solitude. <coughs> Zoop. Heh, <laughs> whatever. I got a bone to pick with that guy myself. Huh. So where are we? So where were we? Boreal's old boss, right? Old geezer, used to work for NASA. Ring any bells? Actually... After they found that crash part of the station, I remember a man from NASA came to our house. Thinking about it now, I feel like I've seen someone like that in Echo Ridge recently. Boreal did say his old boss was seen in the vicinity. It's a solid lead. All right, let's go search Echo Ridge, top to bottom. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, that hint isn't in the uh, in the original game. I will review how to use the Leo Star Force. If you choose the Star Force card you put into your folder from the custom screen, you will instantly be changed into Fire Leo Mega Man. If you have a brother who is registered on the Leo satellite, you can choose their card to use the Star Force too. As Fire Leo Mega Man, you will possess devastating firepower. A charge shot will change to flame, flame Burner, a fire attack with immense power. While you are in this form, the Mega Buster's attack rating is doubled, and you will be able to charge it beyond its normal limit. When you unleash the Flame Burner at maximum strength, it will absorb your next card and increase Flame Burner's damage by an amount equal to the base attack power of that card. However, this can only be done with standard cards that deal damage. Moreover, both the Mega Buster and Flame Burner will break through shields. Be careful, if you are hit by an Aqua attack, you will revert back into Mega Man. Fire Leo's SFB is Atomic Blazer. It's an awesome attack of fiery fury upon your fio fo your fios. Meow. Use the Leo Star Force well, and it will help you protect those you love. Sweet deal. Basically, it's Fire Soul, yeah. Well, it's like Charge Soul from Battle Network 6. Where it, it sucks in the, uh... It sucks in the power of the other cards. Alright, if I had to take a guess, uh, Aaron's... Uh, I almost said Social Link. Um, Aaron's, uh... Thing is gonna be up in, in Nacy's. Because that's where I found him before. There's no point in not getting him. Oh god, does that mean I'm gonna have to send him the code again? No dead ends in this area. This game did the one thing, made one change that I'm very happy about. Best one is in Dream Park. Really? There's more than two? Uh, kind of 
couple. Ah, got it. wise guy that's been going around deleting my precious voiruses. Do you have any idea how long it took me to plant those everywhere, huh? Well, I hope you're ready, because now I'm going to pay you back threefold. Come on, let's teach them a lesson. <laughs> Running like a coward, are you? No, let's not yet. Voirus, yeah. I have a feeling this isn't going to be as easy as I think it'll be. <laughs> let's get them, boys. Oh, maybe it will. Alexander, tornado from nearest enemy. Neat. Salsa flavored Mega Man. That's cool. Not amazing, but pretty cool. Incredibly broken, oh my god. Break time bomb. That's a big time bomb. Bet I'm winning. Wow, that was it. Incredible. You bet I'm winning. All right. Set unblockable bomb attack two penalty. Oh, it's a Giga Chip. Set unblockable bomb attack two pen. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I see. So if that's on, so you can't block that even in PvP. That's ridiculous. So you have to destroy it. Six hundred damage. My God. That is. Technically better than Darkness Hole. <laughs> Bomb can still be destroyed, though. Yeah, that set of 600 damage. I mean, the thing with the thing with Darkness Holes is there's no risk to it. If the enemy has 500 HP, they're done. But I don't know. And this is good for virus battles too, because it takes out multiples. I don't know. Between that and the uh, other thing, it's funny how I have so many Giga Chips and I haven't even beaten the game yet. Most Battle Network games, I'd have barely one by the end. I have six right now. Are all 15 Giga Chips are in this version? Like, you get, you actually can get all 15 of them from all three versions? Or only the fuck? Is it just, like, a few of them from the other versions are in this one? And then the Cygnus or Taurus decides to ram the, into the bomb. It's an instant counter hit for 10 damage. Uh... Wait, I want to go to Dream Island. You get them all. I uh, got it. But it's not really necessary. There's no there's no gates that uh, rely on Giga Chips. In fact, I think this game only counts standard chips. And even even though this game has this version of the game has more than the previous versions, I think it still runs off the. Uh, you just yeah, and I mean I know it does because I read the patch notes. It still only requires uh, 150 instead of 100 all 170. All right. I'm gonna look for that wave hole we mentioned. And then I'll move the story on. That's down there. Uh, 
Octo Icer. Ursula, version 2. Oh, he has all the Terennials. This is uh, his, sp his favorite cards, though. Flame attack, enemy in front. That is a fire attack. Blue ink. You got 12 so far yourself. Got it. I'm probably not fighting, uh... Gemini Spark. Ezra. Icicle, three Icicles freeze enemies. It's probably not super strong. It's going to hit all of them. Yep. Nice. Star frags are always good. There it is. Hello. Okay, I'm connected. Hello, I'm Toasty. I crossed over from another dimension to get here. Let's be brothers. Should I? Toasty is now your brother. I'm connecting from the world of Lunar Knights. Why don't we help each other out? When you find something, yeah, it's, it's in return, I'll send you the rare things I found. Quite a few battle cards that you can't find in your world. And if you know any tips for Lunar Knights, I could use some as well. By the way, there are other portals like this one. Why don't you try? Good things might happen. Oh, it's the exact same dialogue. Toasty, the Triennial of Light. I... Oh, I gotta really... I really gotta send him the code, too. Oh, no. Back in my... Okay, what's this? What is this you just sent me? Back in my day, we had to dislocate one arm to reach the back of the TV. Then we had to blindly, mind you, screw this in, shredding your thumb in the process. And after all that, you had to hope the TV didn't fall, ending your no Nintendo life. Lost a lot of friends this way. Oh, God, it's the RF switch. The original NES... I remember when I thought, like, oh my god, I'll never be able to set up a video game system because of these stupid RF switches, but thankfully we moved to, uh, RBY, so... Or R R R Y U R W Y I don't know. And now we use HDMI, so it it it's all moot. How many Lunar Knights brothers are there? Is it just the three main guys? how to connect a console to an analog TV with your family's Atari 2600. Wow. Uh... Oh, this is actually from Lunar Nights. What the hell? Wave scanner effects for the Lunar Knights cards do exist in the game data. However, real life battle cards them do not exist. So it was never obtainable in the Japanese version. That's interesting. Oh! I think this is different. They changed it completely. In the Japanese version of the game, you don't get you don't get individual uh, brother bands for each of the characters. You just get a single Lunar Knights brother band. And this they made more, I guess, to fill in the empty spots. Who else can you make your brother in this game de uh, without Wi-Fi? Zach, just Zach, right? In the post game.
Because I remember there was there was definitely two slots that were still not filled. Yeah, okay. So they so they essentially increased the number of in-game brother bands from four to seven in this one. So that you always have a choice of who to choose who to choose. Though I would assume that not having Zack is probably not a good idea, because Zack probably has a unique ability. Whereas uh the Lunar Knights, Zack and his Mega Plus One. Uh well that's not too bad. Actually, what is um what does Toasty give me? I have to put in that stupid code again. HP plus twenty and charge plus one, and he gives me I'm assuming they're all gonna give me charge plus one because they they were designed to be a single brother originally. Four, four, and one. That's actually pretty good. Or I could do three, two, and five. So I could either increase my charge level and lower my damage a bit, but but have more rapid. That's pretty good. BN Blaster. Eh, that's not really that worth it. Bear Ring. If I had, um... I mean, this is probably the best use of it, the Hammer Glove, because I have four attack with four charge. Patch makes, makes it Mega Plus Two, though. Oh, that's good. So yeah, he's worth having, and then I guess two of the Lunar Knights bros are worth having. I'm still weak in the knees. Oh, if only I was strong as you. Weren't you sad after you cut our brother band? I hope you've learned your lesson, and you won't do anything like that again. I like how melancholic this version of the song is, and then the later games, you know, now that Geo's kind of, like, opened up and he has friends, it gets a lot more, uh... It gets a lot more upbeat sounding. This version of the song always has, has like, kind of that, like, slow kind of like, almost sad feeling to it. Oh, this feeling, it's like that day all over again. Maybe I'll write about it in my trancer. I mean, he's the only old man here, so what do you expect? Good news, I haven't dropped any frames in the last, uh, 30 minutes or so. Why am I not finding any mystery data at all now? Tove and Ursula. Rock pen- rock rains on far nine panels, okay. Oh, when they mean rain, they mean, like, a, a lot of rain. Ground Crush. Barrier. Hoping for a, a special item. Something like Ursula and Fallout New Vegas, but you can only use it outdoors only once per day. <laughs> Sunlight! Do I already have all your goods? Yes, I do. I think I've bought every HP memory and I've bought every uh, chip possible at this point. Something strange in the air, just like that day, the day of the incident. I've got this strange feeling in my chest, it's just like that feeling I had that day three years ago. On a day like this, it's better that I just have my favorite tropical tea and lie down. But it is a little hard to come by. I believe the owner of Big Wave had some, but I don't want to just walk up to his shop and start shouting, Give me some tropical tea! That's the trouble. Do we know that it's him? 
the looks of his transfer, that's the guy. Yeah. So apparently in the original version of this game, you needed to get inside the shop to do this, but in this version, you could just talk to him over the counter. Surf's up, got some good luck stuff, so take a look. Huh? Tropical tea? Oh, you want that? A single sip whisks you away to a tropical paradise. It's happiness in liquid form, sparkling with the sun on the ocean waves. That's the tea you're looking for, right? That's the cruel angel's tea, sis. What? I don't have any in the store. Well, I'm all out today, but I have some of my own. Huh? You want to see? You want me to give you my stash? Ah, oh, come on, dude. I was gonna save it for tonight. You're giving it to his, You're giving it as a present to an old man. All right, I'll cut you a deal, man. Three thousand zennies. How about it? Lucky for you, I am loaded. Okay, enjoy the tea. Gee, I got tropical tea. Enjoy that tea. Enjoy that tea. Mr. Southern's tropical tea is totally calming. Yeah, Blazing Edge already have that. Tempted to buy it just so it's gone. Oh, cha. I sort of have something I want to ask. Sorry, Sonny, but I don't want to talk right now. Geo showed tropical tea to Mr. Gat. Th that's... That's tropical tea, isn't it? Oh, please let me have it. It's my favorite. Um, well, can you answer my question first? If it's just a question, then sure. Well, you see... So you are Kelvin's son. Yes, I was the one in charge of that tragic space station mission. Yeah, no wonder it went wrong. If that was only three years ago, there's no way your memory wasn't that bad by that point. I have wronged him in the worst way possible. His whole- his name is I Forget. And, and your quest was that he forgot something very trivial. And no matter how much I want to apologize, I don't expect I'll ever be forgiven. But you can make up for what you did, sir. There was a piece of the station that fell back to Earth after the incident, right? Are you thinking of using it to communicate with the station's main section? Yes. If I don't, the whole world will be in danger. That look in your eyes. You remind me so much of your father. Alright, I'll tell you where I hid that piece of the space station. Really? Yeah. So where is it? Where is it? Where did I hide it? How did you hide a space station? What? Well, you see, in order to stop myself from ever telling someone where I'd hidden it by accident, I used an ancient secret technique to wipe that knowledge from my mind. But ever since I did that, my memory's just gotten worse and worse. <laughs> oh, okay. So he wasn't senile. He somehow forced himself to be senile. I imagine he shoved his head in a microwave or something like that. Then you have no idea where it is? Oh, nothing of the sort, Sonny. I figured that someone would ask me someday, so I hid the location in a piece of data somewhere. I'm pretty sure it's in the research facility of one of my past subordinates. I hid it within a program in something that has to do with the space station. Subordinate? Are you talking about Mr. Boreal? Oh, yes, that's the fellow. Who would have thought it would have been an Omicin? If it's with the program, sounds like we should check out some comp spaces. It's something related to the space station. Okay, let's try to find this thing. Thanks a lot, Mr. Gat. Geo gave tropical tea to Mr. Gat. But why did you want to hide it anyway? I heard a piece of the message that the station was broadcasting at the time of the incident. When I heard that the FMians were coming to Earth, I was scared out of my wits. And then a piece of the station fell to Earth. When we examined it, we found the station's communication equipment was still on board. It was broken, but from that we could get an idea of where the space station was. However, by the same logic, the FMians could find out where the Earth was. So in order to prevent that, I tried to isolate the piece in a place where no one would ever find it. I'm really sorry for cutting the crew of the space station off like that, and I did fix the transmitter in case we ever needed to use it to make contact. But as the one who was responsible for the mission, I had to do what, to, I, had to do what I did to protect the Earth from invaders, and that's why I had to let your father disappear. I see, so NASA didn't really abandon my dad. But in essence, we did. I'm really sorry for what I've done. No, I think my dad would understand. Thank you very much. Please tell Aaron I said hi. Which one, the solar boy or the or the guy at, uh, at the space place? Because I know both of them. I know two Aarons. Uh, get a drink. Speaking of tea, Time for my iced tea lemonade.
So I've restocked my I've restocked my drinks, I've restocked my jack links. But now my house has no milk in it. The fucking store didn't send us any milk. I'm so annoyed. I'm down to like literally like a cup of milk left, and I'm I'm very annoyed because so much of the food I eat uses milk in it. I I need to replenish our supply like immediately. Uh, comp space is related to the- it wouldn't be in the rocket, right? Be playing this has been great for you because you actually like the story. This- that would probably sound weird. No, the story's great in this game. Honestly, I love Battle Network and I love Battle Network stories, but let's be honest, this series in general is a big step up in terms of tone. Um, there's so much to this game that, like, Battle Network didn't even touch on. Like, granted, it's still very base-level characterization, but this series, it's, it deals with loss, it deals with, like, broken hearts and stuff like that. If, I, if I'm not mistaken, the story of the second game, the way that plays out towards the end is extremely depressing. The post-game in the second game is very depressing, too. Both of those games, both of that... The second game in general is just a very sad game, despite the more upbeat feeling of it. Uh, Pop in and say what the fuck, that's like the third or fourth time you've talked about no milk. Really? Well, here's the thing, we do shop at home, and we usually order three to four gallons, uh, not gallons, uh, half gallons of milk, because that's about how much I go through every two weeks. Not me specifically, my whole family. But, uh, I'm down to, like, literally, like, the last, like, drop that we have in our containers. And they did not send us any this week. And we're supposed to get more, and it's not happening yet, and it's annoying me. Okay, yada 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 yada. The problem I used to have with ShopRite's milk was that sometimes, and it still happens very rarely, but it does, um... Sometimes their milk comes and it's already expired when I open it. Like, it's very clearly sour by the time I open it. And, it, and we'll keep it in a fridge where it freezes. So it should stay good longer. And it'll be within, within date, within street date. One time at my old job... Oh shit, it was- Oh, it was probably in that satellite. Damn it, I need- We need to go back. Kate, we need to go back! We were never supposed to leave, Kate! Oh, wait a minute, whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I see something up there? Nope, it was just my imagination. I went in there. Did I go in the rocket? I'm gonna go in- because the rocket is technically related to it. One time when I used to work at my old job, uh, there was a container of milk that I opened to put in a milkshake, and I remember the entire thing tasted and smelled very gross. It was- it, um... It, it tasted- it, it tasted like the cow that produced the milk ate way too much, um, like, like, vegetables. And it actually smelled like, it, like, smelled and tasted like vegetable taste. Like, almost like dirt, like fresh earth taste. And I was just like, ugh, why is this so gross? Needless to say, I dumped the whole thing out into a, uh, into the, uh, sink and got rid of it. You could taste that? Yes, you can. I remember a while ago, I think when I first got my this job that I'm at right now, um, I w was seeing my girlfriend on our first date, and uh, I went and got, on my way home, I got a smoothie from a place in Penn Station, and it was like a garden smoothie, and it was all vegetable juice, and let me tell you, it just tasted like dirt. It tasted like fresh earth, and it was very, very unappetizing. Probably inside the, the place. Alright, 
no, it wasn't there. Some brands of water taste that way if they're not cold, yeah. Just don't drink this Dasani and you'll be fine. Dasani's disgusting. One time I read milk that tastes like something was organic milk. It was the best milk I'd have so far. Otherwise, it all tastes the same. Dasani's your preference. Ew. I've heard, like, Dasani's, like, it's really gross water, apparently. It's not fresh, is what I've been, is what I've been told. Or maybe it's, maybe it's the other one. Fiji? No. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, fine, I've been putting electrolytes in- Oh, you've been- Oh, so you've been pur- uh, You've been purifying it, okay. That's probably why. Because I've- Like, I've heard the most complaints about Dasani. I'm pretty sure that's the one people don't like. The milk was called Horizon Farms or something. It's red. Huh. Hillshire Farms. Go meet. That was a meme with me and my friends back in the day. When those when those Hillshire Farms, like, packages... Like, small meat packages. <laughs> oh, man. I'm so good at words. You got nothing to say, buddy? Oh, something to do with the space station. It's probably the thing in his office. Oh, I'm such a moron. No, not the, the drink. I'm pretty sure she was referring to the container. Are you upgraded yet? Alright, can I get a better chip out of you? I saw you giving me hard looks just now. Ain't gonna be soft on you. Don't think it was because we're small, we're a shrimp. Let's do it, Geo. Yep, he's upgraded. Solar Gun V2. Lunar Knight's lot light shoots shot. Lunar Knight's light shots split into V. V has come to. Nice! Cancer Rubble EX, that was a magnificent move. Recognized as a best combo. That combo did 300 points of damage. We should save that one. Wow, it did exactly 300. 
Solar gun, invisible. Oh, that's nice because you get a free invisible if you use that. Time to give this best combo a name. Uh, sunlight. Write a pop up message. Don't I already? Yeah, no. Take this, my love, my anger, and all my sorrow. Uh, okay. Yada yada yada. These are exactly the same. It's probably better to just use this one then, because you get invis out of it as well. Nobody could just beat the crab out of me. I'll be waiting for a rematch. Snip. Alright, well, I was using Cancer Bubble, so it's time to ditch that for EX. Nice. That's 30 more damage. Oh, you could have way more than before. Yeah, but notice no one sells unlockers. I think all the unlocker stuff is, like, quest locked in this game. Like, you only get them by doing, uh, side quests or, uh, mail. Oh, you did find a shop with them. Okay, I guess it's in the post game. Or did I just miss them? Nice. I'm indubitably, undoubtedly, unequivocally, indisputably, unmistakably, undeniably, and irrefutably on the job. In here, in here, in here. Go, 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 go. Uh, I gotta figure out where to go. Right before the final area. Ah, got it. Shit out of here. Alright, uh no, 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 no. <sighs> I've been in space before, you know? So while the fuel may already be gone, I think somehow we can manage to pull it off. <sighs> oh, maybe that isn't it. Oh what? Alright, that's not it. Is there another wave road in here, maybe? Another wave hole that I didn't look into? The museum? I already went in the museum, though. It's not the ticket booth. That thing they call a flat pack, it can really fly. Well, you know what? That's what they say, at least. You know what they say? The more the merrier. Cloaker in this room probably wouldn't be a smart idea because it will just get me into a fight with uh, Cygnus. Welcome to the display comp right now. Okay, so no, no, that won't do. Okay, no, that's not you. I went into the black hole generator. What else is in the museum that I could we could go into? Thunderbolt.
Yeah, I went in there already. That's the only uh, thing that you could pulse into in that area. Meteorite. Oh, look at all these. Item that auto unlocks red mystery waves for use with Lunar Knights. Equip on your head. Use with Lunar Knights. Equip on your torso. Equip on your legs. Fully revised an ally. Rare item that enhances shields. Grants temporary invincibility. Dark sword junk parts. Ant farm keyboard. And a present. We're gonna be sending a meteorite. Found this meteorite. Hope it helps. Oh, it's a little. It's the icon of the Lunar Knights, uh, like junk icon. That's neat. Hey, Geo. Thanks for the meteorite. I feel a lot stronger now. Lucian's level has increased to level 35. Here's something in return. See you. Mega Man got Darkness Sword. Boss, I just got that ship. Nice. Of course, it goes at the very bottom. Lunar Knights cuts row in front and side. Someone on your arm, you're gonna need a ticket for him too. No line cutting, buddy. Speaking of uh, tickets, I'm going to, uh, at the end of October, I'm gonna be going to the, uh, to a Ren Fair. I'm gonna be staying out overnight. It's gonna be fun. Me and my girlfriend are gonna do that for our anniversary. Okay, nothing in doing in there. I think I can think of it being is the is the is like the actual comp space. Oh, looks like there's a power switch. What the hell? How are you supposed to know that that's that that would uh turn on all of a sudden? Or did I just never activate that before? Crap game did not hold my hand. Space colony comp. Something that this has to do with the space station. Could this be it? Nice HP memory. Sweet deal. Ooh, new enemies. Eyes. And now they're deads. They have become past tense. Well, I got Ground Wave 3, which is a new chip for me, technically, so I'm not complaining. But not exactly what I wanted. Oh, hey! 
I think this is the data the old man was talking about? Data about where that piece of the space station's hidden? It's got a strong EM wave around it. Looks like we gotta get rid of the EM wave before we can read the data on the inside. It's probably a virus that's making it. I know, but I have, n I have to deal with it or else. Yeah. Wave battle, right on! Okay. Was not expecting that. Ooh. Zap Joker G. Oh, that thing in the back didn't get hurt. Okay, you have to hit it when the eyeball's facing forward. Alright, the EM wave is gone. Mega Man got NASA data. Take a good look at that NASA data. Those won't work. Thunderball 3. Alright, that is a new card, technically. What's the program in here? Oh, he was down at the bottom. I want to talk to him. I need that flavor text, damn it. Oh, these guys are going to get wrecked by that because they're weak to this. Throw electricity. Underball 3. Damn it. Voltic Eye is probably a very good card. Yeah. Beep beep. It's only a matter of time before humans begin living in space. Soon I too will be making my space debut. Wait, there's no air in space. Waves don't need air to live, do they? Wait, are waves alive? Wait, what are waves anyway? I better not think about it too much. Maybe I should just stay here on Earth. I kind of want it because it's the only card I can get right now that I don't have. Okay, really? Yeah, I got Ground Wave 3. I got it. I, that was the first chip card I got in here. The only thing, the only card I don't have right now is the Voltic Eye. So do odd number of 10s digit damage, which means it'll bring it to even, and then I can follow the radar missile. Damn it! Of course I keep- I'm gonna keep getting the thunder- This is like with the Moai fall from before.
keep seeing the little stool I bought out of the corner of my eye and thinking it's my Tycho drum, and I'm like, why the hell did I put that over there? Because it's circular. It's a pop-out stool, if you saw it on my Twitter. So how viable is Holy Aura, do you think? Um, I don't know. There's only one Aura chip in this game, I know that. What? I thought it automatically homed in. Does it work the same way though? It does double the the holy panel will double your aura. Give this like five more minutes, I'm gonna stop. Tobin! Oh, it doesn't do. It doesn't do the damage, it doesn't do grass damage though. Come on, man. You gotta be kidding me with that shit. This game's great until you need to farm a specific card, then it's not good. See what I mean? This happened with the Moai fall and it got me angry. Life 4 is a Giga card, so if the combo works, the enemy has to break 400 damage. Oh, you mean the best combo? Hmm. That would be a bit more difficult. This is not going to get me anywhere. Mad 91, Mad 92, Mad 93, Mad 94. Definition of insanity is the is the drop rates in this game. Should be an instant kill, right? Yeah. <clears throat> but of course, no chip, even though I got a busting rank of ten. Ten. Even, I don't even know how that's a busting rank of 10. I made one movement and used a, and used a mega chip. That should be an S rank. There we go, Voltic I won. Fucking hell, man. A button to stop cursor, three shots of elect damage. It's decent. Got what I needed. Uh, NASA data. I buried it underneath the Dream Island. The entrance to it is hidden under rubbish, but you can remove the trash kit and get to it. Alright, well, we know what to do now. It's like Magnum, but it pierces and visit and never misses the enemy if it's in the back row. Nice. Let's 
hidden on Dream Island? Well, let's go. I mean, we know exactly where it is. I've, I've looked at the thing to, to move multiple times at this point. Guess, I'm, guess everything's okay between you and Luna again. I'm glad. Backhoe, it moved. Press select to put the card in and maybe... Looks like the backhoe moves. Alright. Okay, I'm counting on you, Shovel Man. Shovel! door. Thanks, Shovel Man. Shovel! You could speak, you know. On the other side of this door. What are you waiting for? Let's go! Y yeah. The, arm the back was a powerful arm to move garbage. So nice. Uh, I love how they moved this entire thing to Dream Island three years ago. This entire underground facility to house this thing. Unless there's no waves down here at all. Attention. No unauthorized persons beyond this point. NASA. Can't get by with all this junk in the way. Controls have been badly damaged. Definitely evidence of a crash. No longer functional cords dangle and hang. Machine parts are strewn about. I think I should have saved before talking to this thing. So, this is the piece of my dad's space station. You think it'll work? It doesn't look too bad, so I think the main system is probably still intact. They may not know enough to fix it. Geo, I'm really surprised to find you here. Who's there? Yeah, how did Aaron know to come here? M Mr. Boreal? Why are you here? I got a call from Ivor after you left. He said you had asked him for his help. Mr. Gat. I never knew it was hidden in a place like this. Well, let's fix this up, shall we? And then we've got to contact NASA. Then we got to contact NASA. Wait, please, don't tell NASA, Mr. Boreal. Geo, I know you feel like you got to do something, but let's be realistic. How do you plan to fight against Planet FM? We don't have any way to fight them. I... well... Another earthquake? That's... Wave ball. It's a synergy vortex. He was able to make it down here? Wow, does he, he walk closer to him? Gemini! Get back, Geo! Sorry, but I'm not going to let you interfere. Yow! Ah! Ugh. What's wrong? Why not change into wave form? The wave ball has changed this area into a wave space. So you should be able to, right? <laughs> but if you want to offer me a free shot, I might just hit you with another electric shock. <clears throat> Run, Geo! A transformer would leave me wide open. My only option is to somehow slow him down. 
in just a little. Now to finish you off. We wouldn't want something to interrupt us again because it was having too much fun. <gasps> what? Pat! Uh, uh, don't worry about me. Geo, transform now! Gotcha. EM wave change. Geo stellar on the air. Suddenly, Pat. Gemini, I'm your opponent. Geo, you... What? Never fails. Someone always gets in the way. Now that you're Mega Man, I'm through playing around. Ha! Wow, now there's three of him. But how? I recreated the shape from data in my memory. I don't need Pat or his body anymore. Prepare yourself, Mega Man. Mega, he's attacking. Don't get sloppy now. Wave battle, right on. Let's just fight over Pat's body. There's two Pats now. Now that was contrived. Wouldn't be easier just to force himself into Pat. Yeah, probably would, but they're not going now. done. Apparently, originally, this fight is just the standard version again, but then instead, in this patch, they upgraded it to the EX version, but also made the stats slightly lower, apparently, just to kind of balance it. So, uh, Gemini Spark in this game actually has four versions. Oh, it looks so weird there. No. How could I lose again? Andromeda, avenge us! Nice of that wave ball to float down there to get destroyed with it. Geo, what just happened with you? One second. Pat! Uh, Geo, I don't think this makes up for what I did to you, but I, I still hope I can be your brother. Thud. Pat. He's alright. He just fainted. But we should take him to Amakin just to be safe. Are you okay? I'm okay, but Pat, we should hurry. Alright. At Mr. Boreal's request, Mr. Dubious was contacted and Pat was rushed to Amakin. Afterwards... Quite an unbelievable story, but you becoming friends with an Ephemian named Mega and changing into Mega Man, well, it means that you have the power to fuse with an Ephemian. And if I could fix that transmitter and send you into space, then maybe you could stop the Ephemian's plan. Gotta hurry. If we don't, it might be too late for us. Sorry, but I have to think about it. What? Just because you have the power to fight the Ephemians, 
That doesn't mean I could send you off into outer space. But... What if something happened to you? How would your mother feel if she lost you, the only link she has left to your father? How would I be able to face her then? I'm the one who sent your father into space. Me! No matter how small of a chance, as long as there's hope, then we can't give up. My dad used to say that. I'm not who I was before. I'm not afraid of losing people anymore. And I fight so I can protect those I love. Aaron, I'm going to put everything into this tiny sliver of hope and try. Kelvin. Mr. Boreal. Give me one day. I'm gonna get this up and running by tomorrow. Really? Yeah, but you have to promise me something. Promise? Okay. Come back alive. You could promise me that, right? I will. I promise. Okay, you go home and get a good night's sleep. Nod. Nods, assuringly. I'm doing the right thing, aren't I, Kelvin? Let's go home. Tomorrow's the final showdown. There's, uh, no quests I could do, right? Welcome back. Hey Geo, I went to Times Square, right? It's so strange, I can't remember if I did or not. Maybe I should go to bed early today. Damn it. Hate that. Ah, my faithful warriors. You did well to retrieve the Andromeda Key. Thank you, your majesty. I will now lift the seal on Andromeda, and with it, seal the Earth's fate. Your majesty, we must report that Gemini has been deleted. It doesn't matter, his absence changes nothing. He was a fool. After I brought him back, he carelessly throws my efforts away. But never mind him, my warriors. Andromeda must be prepared. Your majesty. Roger. As you wish. Chuckle Fuck Brigade is coming back the next morning. It's time. You leave it now? Yeah. I, uh. What's up? Um, I'm sorry that you got caught up in this fight. And I'm sorry about your old man. Are you okay? This isn't like you at all. Plus, this isn't just your fight anymore. This is a fight for the fate of the whole Earth. And I went along with everything. Because I wanted to see what happened to my- what hap- uh, Because I wanted to see with my own eyes what happened to Dad. So say something happy like you always do. Geo. <laughs> looks like I'm rubbing off on you. Okay, let's get out of here and mangle some Ephemians. Yeah. Actually, before we go into space, there's some place I want to go. Is that okay? Your usual spot? Yeah. Oh, and we should say something to Mom, too. You gotta hurry. Caution, NASA. Hello, this is a message from NASA. Currently, there are invaders approaching Earth from outer space. We're conducting an investigation, and we strongly urge citizens to be on the alert. Wow, why would you send that out to the general public? And cause mass hysteria. You really think that was the smartest thing to do, NASA? 
Good morning. Are you going out somewhere? Yeah. But those strange quakes haven't stopped. Maybe it's best if you didn't. I really have to go out there, Mom. Yeah, do not panic. We're monitoring the situation. <laughs> Sorry, it's just... On the day your dad left, I did the exact same thing. I asked him over and over, Do you really have to go into outer space? And your dad said, I really have to go out there. Like father, like son, I guess. I saw your dad in my dreams last night. He was smiling as he faded into the distance. <laughs> I was thinking, what if you went out one day and never came back? It's okay, I'll come back, Mom, I promise. Gio, I really got to get going. See you later. Going to go where you always go? Are you going to go to and always going to always going to always going to always going Anything new? No. Mope, stellar, bad joke, yeah. I think it was a pretty good joke. EM waves are headed this way. I can't move very well at all now. Then Gaga. Me? Then Gaga. The price of freedom is steep. They're both good voice actors. If you saw Vinny stream the other day, and I knew about this before, but um, the guy who used to voice Zack... Um, was also the guy who played Endless Mike in uh, Pete and Pete. He was the original Zack voice. Dad, I'm going to where you are now. That's what anime characters say before they kill themselves when they're missing a loved one. Jesus. Come on, Mega. Let's go. Right. Let's go. Ah. Hey, Zach, can I get your brother banned now? I could use some buffs. What are you all doing here? We got a call from Mr. Boreal. Are you really going to the space station? You shouldn't have to go. Can't the adults do anything? I know you're Mega Man, but going into space is too much, even for you. That's right. Won't you please rethink this? Everyone, thanks for worrying. I know it might be a fight that I can't win, but I have to go. It may be sad, but if I fight and spare someone that sadness in the end, then I have to at least try. And that's why I have to go. No, that speech was too cool! I can't counter that! He's a real man. Hm. <laughs> so nothing we say can change your mind? Yeah. But I'm going to promise you guys the same thing I promised Mr. Boreal. I'll come back alive. You can count on that. Geo. Alright, I believe in you. You're gonna save the world. I believe in you, too. Well, I'm going to worry about you, but only a little, and as a brother. <laughs> so you'd better come back, you hear? I hear you. Thanks, everyone. I'm off. I know you'll come through for us. You better come back, you hear me? Good luck, Geo. Damn it. Actually, no. Pat said Amakin. I want to go see if he's there. See if I can talk to him. Another fun bit of trivia. Late on me. here. Mr. Boreal's really busy. It's predicted the Milky Way will in 4.5 billion years collide with the Andromeda Galaxy. Ooh, wow. 
really puts things in perspective. That we're just here for the ride, and then when it's over, it's over. Doesn't matter what happens between now and then. Yeah, and that's why Andromeda in this game is a plant-eating super weapon. Makes sense. That's just not here. Fly like that or, or wave roads. Looks like that's a mail. Again, I did that? Unbelievable. Make it home. I won't be able to lecture you if you don't get around safe and safe. Uh, I won't be able to lecture you if you don't get back safe and sound. So be careful, okay? Hang tough, man. I believe in you. You could save the Earth. So go get him, brother. Please give it your all, Geo. Remember, I'll be cheering for you. What the? Slipping on the job, eh? Mr. Boreal? Mr. Boreal? What should I do? I ask for too much. Hmm? Oh, Geo. This is how I always sleep. Splayed out on the floor like a dead man. Aw, oh, dang it. Looks like I fell asleep. Oh, you were just sleeping. Phew. So, is it fixed? Of course. Oh, wait a sec. Power on. Right, it's working. Hey, Geo, put on your visualizer. Okay. Oh, there's a wave road suddenly. That's probably how I'll get to the station. Second FM could have nailed Boreal and ended the fight before it began, but hey, yeah. Okay, let's go. Wait. Sonya. Gio. Take me with you. Sonya. You can't because I need you to protect everyone here on Earth. After I leave, you're the only one who could fight back against any Ephemians. But don't worry, I'll protect the Earth. So I want you to protect all the people. Gio. Alright, I understand. I believe in you, and I'll be waiting. Good. I'm going now. Mr. Boreal, thank you for everything. I don't like being powerless to do anything, but you're the only one we could count on now. Good luck. Here I go. EM wave change. Geostellar. On. The. Air. I 
Hang on to your pants, Geo. This is gonna be one bumpy ride. You bet. leaving you no matter what, so come back safely. I'll never forget the day of that accident. One day I will find my friend Kelvin. It's been a while since I've seen another wave. I've been asleep for a long time. Welcome aboard. Here's a sleeping sliver of hope. A piece of a satellite launched three years ago. Ice Meteor 3. Wow, finally. Shower near standing with ice. Why do I still have two in here? Much better chips I could equip in there. It's like standard, uh, viruses for Dream Island. So oh, here's the subcard guy. Oh, he's got stuff. He's got new items, too. He's got chips I don't have. Matches only. Use elemental card. Okay, yeah, let's buy that. Arbo Edge. I think I already have the star version of that one. Typhoon Dance I definitely have. Poison Burst. Attack using poison panels on the field. If I use Queen Ophiuka with that, that'd be pretty good. Freeze Knuckles new. Yeah, there's the Unlockers. D Energy. I think I have Typhoon and Arbo Edge already. Yeah, there's Arbo Edge. I have Star Arbo Edge. And Ty same with Typhoon Dance. Up and get in the space. You're not getting cold feet, are you? Nice. Right as I was about to walk into it. Oh, look. Junk O2. It's like junk, but more advanced. I only get 10 zenny for it. We're getting close to the exit. Oh, look, that thing came in. That thing played into the plot. Get ready to come out of standby. We're just a hop away from the space station. Right, we're in space now. This is the space station? Yeah, look down there. This music's good. Oh, we're really in outer space. Oh yeah, what about air? Well, you're in waveform, you don't need air. But who knows if there's any in the real world. I think there might be some left, but without pulsing out, we won't know. I hope there will be. But then I can't... But then, I can't turn back now. Forward is the only way I can go. Purple mystery data. Nice, HP memory. I am level 70 now. On the monitors, a blue let on the monitor in blue letters is a message. Frequency 8413 kilohertz. Service module. Control panel to monitor this module's energy. Frequency yellow letters is a message. Frequency 9861 kilohertz. Shirts drone about, no big deal. Emergency oxygen tanks, but looks like they're empty. Oh, what's this? Another HP memory 20, nice. There's some space food on the shelf. It looks well preserved. It's probably not a good idea to eat it. On the monitor in red message red letters is a message. Frequency 2183 kilohertz. K 
cable and steel wrapped in a special cloth. Special cloth. Whoa. Doors and electronic lock. I won't accept any of my commands. I've got to get this door open. I guess we have to open it from the wave world. Hmm. Gotta find a wave hole. Hmm, maybe if I use that card. I missed what it said. I think it said red frequency. Okay, key man, do your thing. Open sesame. Open sesame. No good, I can't get it to open. Should I give it another try? Okay, what's the red one? Hello? 21837, or 2183. Wow, 2183, Jesus. Look closer, there's a small monitor displaying red frequency. 2183. Thanks, key man. Open sesame. All I can say. In the locker are tools to do work outside. Spacesuit looks hard to put on alone. Echoes from inside the wave ball. Hello. Okay, I'm connected. Hello. Oh, it's Nero. I'm Nero. I crossed over from another dimension to get here. Let's be brothers. Well, we can for now, I guess. I'm connecting from the world of Lunar Knights. Why don't we... Yeah, alright. It's the same exact shit. I'm the Dark Terrenial Nero. Wow. It's the cat from Sailor Moon, yeah. Well, and I have charge plus five. Five and four, four uh, attack. So wait for me to get five attack and, and five charge? No. This is still the best option. But now I'm gonna have super fast charge shots, at least. Voltic I1. Ah, oh, I didn't even need to farm for 10 minutes to get that. Speaking of. Nice, exactly what I wanted to get out of that. Spacesuit comp. Everything's all good to go. I better pulse out. Nope. Get ready to farm all the level 3 chips right. Most of them are going to be in here, aren't they? I forgot, uh, Flicker Kick hits wherever the, uh, enemy is. Beep, beep, beep. It's no good. He's broken. Beep, beep, beep. Crushing loneliness of being a program, like, out here.
Damn it. Now I'm getting Voltic Eyes when I don't want them. Mega Weapon Card Finder. Hell yes. Only battle cards from battles. Attack one. It, it's, it's stats are way lower. But I still have max charge, which is nice. Let's be honest, I'm not going to be using the, the Buster all that much anyway. I think the card finder is probably going to be the, the, the weapon to carry me for the rest of this. That's a new enemy. One second. Ooh. Sausage for dinner tonight. Ugh. Sits in my stomach weird. Beep beep. Oh, I see it's still possible to get here from the outside. The system I operate is just barely running in safe mode. You better hurry if you want to continue through here. Beep beep. Megaman got Ursula. Is that the chip Ursula? Yes, it is. Flame attack on enemy in front. Let's uh, get rid of Iceman here too for that. energy. Nice. McCleaver. Cleavy McCleave face. Wow. Bungle that hard. Something I do appreciate about this game is that the holy the holy panel does resemble the uh, the holy panel from Battle Networks two and three rather than four and on, where it's just a glowing panel. They went back to the Battle Network two and three style for it. the service module comp space. I, I do what I can to make sure that humans' lives into space are as comfortable as p possible. Beep. Oh, man. It doesn't speak anymore. Wow, so everything's just breaking here. These programs are literally dying. You're watching these programs disintegrate in real time. Damn one I want, please. Did I ever get something out of this comp space? I guess I must have. Progs and Hurts are always scared because if their machines break, yeah, exactly. They just die. There we go, Berserk Sword 1.
cool music for this area. Can't remember what the gimmick here is, though. Hold it, I'm sensing some bad vibes. Bad vibes? What do you mean? There's something bad just up ahead. <laughs> but I guess if you think about it, this is our enemy's home turf. It'd be odd if they weren't here. Anyway, be careful and don't let your guard down. Let's go. Roger. Roger. I don't think I like this setup. Launching security code input screen. Use your stylus to connect the stars and complete the constellation. Okay, thankfully you can use the touchscreen. Not your favorite gimmick, yeah. Aura! Absorbs all damage less than 100. Oh, that phrase is going to be very important this week. Um, it is, what is it? It's the 30th now? Two more days until Stone Ocean uh, Segment 2 comes out. I think I will probably be saving it for this weekend, but I will be watching the whole thing before uh, before weekends end. I am going to be home this weekend, so... I love the icon for the ore. I don't know what enemy that's supposed to be, but they look powerful. They look buff. Straight up buff Riku. Duo? Perhaps. Perhaps it's duo. Maybe it's duo. I don't know. Chip. Plasma Gun 3. Okay, it's a plus sign. Not too bad. Attack three. Nice. But I already had that. Literally with the chip that I had in my in my folder already. Yeah. Whoops. Alright, whatever. Black hole one. Wait, what's the difference between that and the Enemies with less than 100 HP are deleted. Oh, so it's like a weaker version of the Giga Chip. Darkness Hole. 
We want four jet attacks with a star card. 400 damage per jet attack three. Yeah. Broken. Yeah, it's just a plus sign. Okay. Like one of the, just one of those in Pegasus Magic GX is a total of 1,250 damage on its own, yeah. Okay, we've seen everything there is to see in this one. This is gonna get way more confusing as we go along. To be honest, I do like the music in the Star Force series, but this game definitely is the weakest soundtrack of the three. But this is this is the second best. Uh, this is the second best Final Dungeon theme of the series. Confirming. Code has been confirmed. Security lifted. I congratulate you on making it this far. Sorry, but do you think you could let us through? <laughs> you think I'll let you pass just because you asked? I don't think so. Now a deletion, that's a different story. Get in our way and we'll show you deletion. Wave battle, right on. You'll bow before my grace. East block. Nice, Cygnus Wing EX. Cause I got an S rank on an EX form. Ugh, I can't believe I was at last at least I'll be a star in the sky. <laughs> He delete. He delete. Gotta hurry. Beep boop. All right, I unlock the door. Onward. There's nothing else to do in this room. Gotta press on. Module temperature control panel. Temperature set to just the right level. 
air circulator. Doesn't seem to be working. This won't budge either. It's the only way open is from the wave world. I'll look for a wave hole. the other side if I don't get this pile of stuff out of the way. Looks like a lot, but I've got to try. Hmm? What's up? <sighs> it's kind of hard to breathe. I thought there was supposed to be air in here. Maybe there's a problem with the air system. That's not good. What am I supposed to do? How should I know? But it's got to be something you could do by yourself since you're the only one here. If you don't do something fast, you're going to run out of air. What am I supposed to do? Hard to breathe. Gotta get some air quick. Thermo man, I'm counting on you. Thermo man is in the house. So what'll it be? Hotter or colder? Air. Whoosh! Windy days are coming. Much better. Thanks, Thermo Man. You're welcome. The air's pretty stable, so back to the pile. Air rumbling out of the air circulator. Oh? Look real close, there's a wave hole here. Nice. Okay, gotta move this trash out of the way. Oh, he can just do that. It seems the system removes CO2 from the air inside the station. Locked. You can't. Oh, you can open it with a sun key. Oh, I need a. I need a lunar night item to open that one. Okay. This is a guaranteed win, uh, new item either way. Tailburner 3. Wait, didn't I already have Tailburner th Ugh, I don't know. Beep. Long ago, I used to regulate the air circulation system, but since the accident, everyone and most of the waves are gone. Berserk Sword 1. AC Mod Comp. Alright, let's get this one over with the button there. Up my sleeve. Let's get it here. All right, let me put Cygnus Wing. I forgot. I got Cygnus EX. There we go. 170 damage around the edge. I spend my days keeping the air in this lonely space in tip-top condition. Beep beep. What are you doing here? Could it be that we're back on Earth? We're not? Oh. When there were humans around, my existence had meaning. But now, what purpose do I even serve? Beep beep. Nice. That's new. That's new. That's new. That's new, too. Tobey.
Tailburner 3, damn it. Why is it always the one, like, the one ship I don't need is the one it'll give me? I like this. There we go. Guaranteed big get. Dorito flavor. God, it's such a good way to use chips. Jumbo Hammer 3. Where's Jumbo Hammer 2? I don't have that yet. Yeah, you missed that car too. Damn it. Damn it, Bobby. I don't know, you look at this, two green bursts. What a waste. Alright, you know what, we'll just do this the easy way. Virus is truly annoying. Magic Crystal One. All right, I'm guessing those uh, the the upgraded versions of those are post game. Gatling Three. I'm back here again. Okay. I want to know what's in the red mystery data. Beaver. These are the same ones from before, right? Yeah, whatever. I got an instant kill. Yeah, it was. Please enter security code. Cherry. Cherry Coke is the mystery data. Someone call Savage Garden. We need them to decipher this mystery data. N no. <laughs> A very hard no right there.
swear to God, if it was Nickelback, it's... <laughs> God damn it. Don't follow any any links online that tells you to download the new Nickelback album for free, because it will download the new Nickelback album to your hard drive. <laughs> I'm not going to remember that pattern. Pretty sure that's just... Heavy Cannon or whatever it is. Which I already have. Right, I'm going in a circle. than malware, yeah. Some may say that what that is malware. Wave. Oh. I think I'm gonna get a we mega weapon. Sweet Mirage. A charge shot that confuses foes. 2-3-2. Two, two. Eh. Not really that great. I mean, card, let's be honest. Card finder's kind of where it's at for me right now. <laughs> the entire gimmick of this dungeon's optional, too. If you know the answers, you don't have to go through it at all. Easier way for me to remember it. So wait, white and blue are connected. White's connected, or blue's connected to all the ones around it. Red and blue are connected. And then red's connected to all the ones around it, and then green is connected to that bottom one. So red, blue, white are connected. That's what we have to remember. Red, blue, white are connected. 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 Blue's connected to the rest of them. There we go. Hey, Gem, how you doing? Error! Shit. Uh, well, that's not good. It was definitely these two. These three were connected. Red was connected to these two. And the one next to us. And 
then green was connected to that. And then blue was con- Shit. Alright, I gotta take another look then. Are there any that just aren't connected to anything? Maybe? It's connected to those three. Oh, I see. Blue isn't connected to both of the st all the stars. Blue's connected to one star, and then that other star's connected to the other one. Got it. I don't want to lose my brain, so... I kind of have to speed up or I'm going to forget it. This to this, and then this to this, and then this to this. There we go. Just finished an assignment yesterday. Nice. Always a good feeling. Guess you passed Pat Bad Bepper. Guess you got I got past Cygnus. But I'm not going to let you get any further. You wanna open the door, you gotta get by me. Not to brag, but you were in time you were on time with it. Nice! I was awful at getting my Simon Stone on time. Homework sucked. Your trip through Spray Sun's here! Here he comes. Wave battle. Right on. Turn you into Stardust! having a cow, man. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Prepare to become space dust! EX, three star frags, nice. You, how can you have so much power in that tiny body of yours? I didn't think it was possible until I met him either, but this is the power of trust. Guys like you who can't trust your companions can't understand this power. Bye bye, Taurus. Power from trust. As if Emians who know only of loneliness can't. Understand, Omegasus, you really are an. What was trying? What was Torch trying to say at the end there? No idea. Look, let's just get going. Uh, okay. Looks like we can unlock the door with this. Okay, the door's been unlocked. Let's go. Power module. This won't budge either. The only way to open is from the wave world. Look for a wave hole. An electric generator. It supplies the station with power. Hmm? There's a note. Kelvin, please reply. Please repair this power. Kelvin, please repair the power supply lines. 
the store won't open unless the power malfunction is fixed. The Ava, Ava, the Ava, what? The Ava robot is on standby outside. Use the control panel to maneuver it. Thanks, Steve. This was written for my dad. Ava robot, outside, repairs. Anyways, I guess I better check out that control panel. <clears throat> This control panel operates the Ava robot. Good grief. Looks hard to operate. Ava stands for extravehicular activity, right? If it can fly around outside, then... Let's put three and three together here. This is the control system for the outside repair robot. Power switch. Is this it? No orange Fanta, yeah. Those Chrono Trigger robots. Okay, now it's Propeller Man's turn. Wee. Reach the target. Time to get fixing. Finished. Okay, two more spots. Let's go. One last spot. Let's go. Finished. That's all of them. Now the electricity should work. Alright. Thanks, Propeller Man. No prob. Onward. Power levels of each module displayed here. The system distributes power to each of the modules. Space Station gets its power to move from this generator. circle of uh, wave roads. Guaranteed new chips. Two. Big ass two. Alright. This is weird. Got design to it. The cleaver, mag okay, so these are both the same ones I already had. Look at those other robot men there are characters here, yeah. Nice HP memory. Cool. Zoop down there. So used to seeing them as bosses, yeah. Well, I mean, these are all just like individual ones. They they aren't really. They're not really. I don't know. It is interesting though to have the concept of Nabbies like just exist as uh, characters instead of bosses. Sword 3. I don't think I have a Brave Sword 2. 
money. Nothing else hidden here, huh? for sure there'd be a panel here, but I guess not. Hello, Kenneth. How are you doing? Enemies deleted. Yep. Enemies pulped. Wow, even more money. Alright. Probably gonna be Ofuka this time. Holy panel. Nice. Doing good, just chirping and lurking. Hey, those are the be two best things you could do. Ooh. Not guaranteed new chip here, but pretty close. Chances are high of getting a new one. Of course, I get the one that I already had. Uh, this game sucks. It knows which. It's like the opposite of those odds that like increase the chances of getting something you don't have. This one knows what you have, and it constantly increases the chance of getting the same one. Uh, I have no idea. This looks like it might be Libra, just because of how few stars there are. Ooh, another new one. They really kind of backload all the uh, high-level viruses into these last couple areas, huh? I'm noticing that this is kind of just a straight path. Not a whole lot of divergence happening here. Go chain bubble three. Why is there? You see that? A little tiny like glitch in the texture over there. If I, this were on the switch, I'd zoom in. But you could see that, right? It's like right, right to the right and up of Geo. That's interesting. It's probably there to begin with. Two thousand zennies. that cracker. Cliffy, sorry, that's what it's called now.
All right, I don't get affected by poison panels. It's a float shoes. Damn it. Yeah, this game's default power-ups really nullify a lot of the game's difficulty. <laughs> Square. Square. Oh, just use this. Perfect. The win button. Press A to win. And of course, more purple ink. Oh my god. Game sucks. Square, okay, square, and then t it branches off in two directions. Uh, off to white, and then off to that star in the corner. From the star that's closest to it. the invisible path in the next area is Wave Road. No, I don't. I may have known it at the time, but I probably didn't know it. don't know now. Oh, it's Yep, I was right. Libra. Look at how few uh, stars that was. I'm surprised. I didn't think you'd get to me. But I won't let you get past me. <laughs> What's a pair of skills gonna do to us? You and your insults. You've just said your last. These scales are gonna weigh your sins and then serve you the punishment you deserve. Now, Omegasus, face the punishment of your betrayal! <coughs> Geo! Wave battle, right on! The scales have spoken! sucks. Tornado from nearest enemy. Oh, I was too quick. No, ah, oh, fuck. Well, whatever. What I meant to do. Gals. No, 
You may have beaten me, but there is nothing but doom and destruction in your future. Andromeda is... waking. Andromeda... Andromeda's almost fully awake. We gotta hurry, then. Okay, I got the door open. Let's go. Legs go, Mega Man. Saint Seiya the place. <clears throat> Mega, is he? Even without being Mega Man, you could tell. Yeah, beyond this door is the FM King. And Andromeda. Behind here. But first we have to get this door open. You got it, kid. You bet, kid. Looks like this door has to be open from the Wave World. There are cords ripped out from the walls. What could have happened here? This is the space where the Spatian crew relaxed and spent their private time. Beds, no bar. Lame, yeah. Every time you mention Andromeda, I think of a character in that anime and just get... Yeah. Ah, that's... That is... It's a picture of me. Yeah, this is where your dad, Kelvin Steller, was during the incident. This is where dad... That day, three years ago, at the command of the FM King, we invaded the space station, took all of its passengers, and held a trial. The FM King found them all guilty and sentenced them to death. He sentenced them to... No. Before the sentence was carried out, I was the jailkeeper, as it were. And that's how I met your dad. Kelvin kept poking into my business, and when I'd noticed, he'd act like it was nothing. Then one day, just as I'd gotten the Andromeda key, and was about to escape from the station... Mega, what are you planning on doing? One way or another, I'm gonna take out the Ephemians. I've gotta get going before they catch me. Didn't know you for long, but it's been fun. Wait, Mega. What? Can you take us with you? What are you talking about? Is your head on straight? Trial objection. You guys are humans. How am I supposed to bring you along? Must have been a kangaroo Ephemian at that trial. <laughs> Turn our bodies into EM waves, please. If we humans are radiated in enough Z-waves, which you aliens emit with your bodies, then we should turn into waves as well. I guess if you soak up enough Z-waves, your bodies would lose mass and you'll turn into waves, but... Listen, if we stay here, we're goners anyway. No matter how small of a chance, as long as there's hope, we can't give up. Please, Mega. You know what my situation is, right? Mega, why don't you give up on revenge and come to Earth with us? I'm sure you'd get along great with my son. Go to Earth? Even if I turned you guys into waves, how are you planning on finding your way back? You don't become all-knowing just because you're a bunch of waves. You get lost in space and you'll be wandering the stars forever. I'll send an access signal for my transfer to my sons. If the signal's picked up, then it should guide us to where he is. It's not too late, Mega. Throw away the Andromeda key. Come with us. Ha, <sighs> stop. I'm not looking for a place to rest. I have only one goal, to defeat the FM King. You wouldn't mind soaking up some Z-Waves? It, it might kill you. Sorry, but I'm not taking you guys with me. But if you want to go home that badly, I could change you into waveform. But after that, you guys are on your own. Mega. Thank you. I'll get the others. After that, I changed all the passengers, starting with your dad, into EM Waves. Then as we were escaping from the station... Taurus, who was looking for me, suddenly attacked. It was a violent attack, and when I had the chance to look around, Kelvin and all the others had vanished. All that was left was his trancer. I was hurt, but I, fell, 
and I flew towards the signal Kelvin's transfer was sending, and followed it. And that's how I ended up where you were, Geo. Z-Waves, you mean to turn to a Zygarde? <laughs> <clears throat> Not Z-Cells. Dad, what happened to him? Taurus's attack was aimed at me, so I don't think Kelvin and the others were hit. I think they're probably still out there in their waveforms, lost. But if they're in waveform, then that means they might still be alive. They might be, but the chances are slim. I know. But if there's even a sliver of a chance, then I'll keep the hope alive. So where's his transfer now? Hmm, we might find out. Come on, Mega, let's go. We gotta go protect the Earth, so there'll be one dad. <laughs> so there'll be one dad afterwards. We, everyone else can die as long as one father remains. We'll be fine. We gotta go protect the Earth, so there'll be one when Dad comes back. Yeah, I don't want to think about how to explain it to your dad if he comes back and finds the Earth a mess. Yeah. I can't go with you. We're just not compatible. There's a photo of the mother and her child. At the bottom it says, Come home safely, Dad. Geo. Be careful, honey. Hope. Data shows that they had planned to form an interplanetary brother band. Hmm? Look really close. There's a wave hole here. This pan this main control panel- the main control panel for this lab. So this is where my dad worked. We share one dad. Yes, test bond for come. Oh, I have these already. At least dad will take us to Space McDonald's. Yes. I had McDonald's twice this weekend. And you feel really gross afterwards. Oh, he only shoots straight, okay. Memory. Nice, nice, nice. <sighs> beep, beep. Grunt. Ugh. Generate! And generate some more. If I don't keep this up, the other machines will stop working. I'm working hard here. Sometimes I just want to take a break. Is that too much to ask? Generate! And generate some more! I'm only gonna make chicken and some nuggies since they keep taking away all the good food. I got a double quarter pounder with cheese on Friday night, and then I got a quarter pounder with cheese on, uh. on, uh. Sunday evening. We were just too lazy to go anywhere else. These hurts are depressing, yeah. Oh, Black Hole 1, I already have that. These hurts need a Hurts Donut. Red. I need a Sun Key to open that one. Working hard or hardly working? Nerding it up or geeking it down? Where's this invisible wave road? Oh, I think I know. It's off one of the small edges. Okay, so I have those already. I don't need them. Well, don't want them. Don't need them. Get rid of it. How was the con? Oh, it was pretty good. I met some friends that I've never met in person before, which was really nice. It was very short. There wasn't a whole lot of programming going on at it. It was a very, it's a very small con, but uh, it was nice. It was very fun. Just driving around in Philadelphia is a, a pain in the ass because all the streets are, are one way. Beep beep. 
If you happen to see a virus that looks like a dark vortex, be careful. It will only take a small amount of damage unless you attack it with sword-type weapons. Beep beep. Remember the path in the bottom right. Oh, okay. Oh, the fox. Wow, so it just doesn't hit if, if they're not on the same row. Okay. Whatever. Star frags? Okay. Open it with the sun key. Well, I'm probably not getting any of those, so... There we go. Just what I needed. There it is. Whoa. Trippy. Living module comp. So lonely. All alone in space. Are you lonely too? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Please don't feel so lonely. Oh. If you wouldn't mind, please accept this. It's proof that I am here. Mega Man got Lonely Heart. I am here. Oh, I thought that was a weapon, but apparently not. Pain memories of a lonely being. Okay, uh, that must be a key item for something later, I guess. Remember that at all. Remember that weird mirror? Oh, okay, so this is new. Entirely new. Nice HP memory. Cool. Checks out. Guess we're too lonely together with Mega, yeah. One. Cover 300, nice. I'm putting the star card in now because I got rid of that. Why am, I gonna, why am I still using Wide Wave 2? I have a Wide Wave 3. Also, Plat... Well, I guess I can keep Plasma Gun. If anything, I should get rid of Heavy Cannon. It's kind of just not worth the damage. Power up 100 attack, wow. That requires an item object on the field, right? I 
me Thunderball 2s. star in there. I know it's a kind of cheaping out, but here at the Recover 300, because having that heal always available is definitely a good uh, ace in the hole. standard chips. Nice. Anyway. Fourth area. Oh, there's a lot here. Oh, Moai. Mother Moai. Yeah, I probably did the first time I played it. Jumbo Hammer 3, of course. Couldn't be the chip I need. Black Hole 1, damn it. He loves doing shit I already have at me. Sticky rain? Sticky note. Probably should have used those, uh, chips first. Wasn't even worth it. Nice. It's a green burst, but whatever. That's new. That's good. Oh, there's way too much to remember here. Okay. Junk Cube 2. Nice. That's new. What? 
Oh, whoops. So it's a circle. Oh, good. Guaranteed a uh, new chip. Nothing here. All right. Time to get the solution to this stupid puzzle. Who's the character in the save screen? I didn't see who it was there. Oh fuck, that thing had too much HP. I didn't see what it is. It changes depending on, on factors. Like, when you have more brothers, more people will show up on the screen. <clears throat> Damn it. Couldn't be Sticky Rain. Like, it changes every time. Sometimes it's Geo, sometimes it's Mega, sometimes it's one of your brothers. This is the one that's gonna get me everything. Uh, it's a circle with blue g branching out to the white and the star below it, and then red branching out above from its spot as well. So blue with two circle, blue two branches, red one branch. You don't have enough memory in the memory card. <laughs> Which Sonic game is that from? That's not, a. Uh... That's not Sonic Adventure 2, right? There's no time to be listening to music. Okay, we gotta get back. on the PS2 or something older, so it's probably Sonic Unleashed. Or Sonic, uh... Yeah, probably Sonic Unleashed. <clears throat> Alright. Wait, no. So it's a circle like this. Then you have red branching out here. You have blue branching out this way. And you have blue branching out down here. There we go. Snake. Thank god that's over. D energy. Yeah, that's Luna. That character. 
who was actually taken over by this character we're about to fight right now. Well, you're the last one, Snake Woman. Snake Woman is such an unrefined name. I, Ophiuka, Guardian of the FM King, will not allow a single vermin like you to get through this final door. Geo, the FM King is just beyond this door. We have to get past her. Don't let her stop us here. Got it. Wave battle, right on. You don't have it. You don't have the ant. You don't have the antidote to my venom. Let's do it. Yeah, Sock Unleashed had a port on the Wii and PS2. Like, they purposely made a last gen port for it. Shit. I'm taking her out. Your Majesty, forgive me. You, a cursed Omegasis, Andromeda. Uh, uh. All that's left is the FM King and Andromeda. We've got to hurry. Last lock is open. This is it. The final battle. Right. Can I get a hoo yeah? The FM King is just beyond here. Once you change into waveform here, there's no turning back. No turning back. The area ahead is a warped world. The FM King Z waves are so strong they've turned reality into waveform. Basically, it's half real world and half wave. You can't escape into the real world if you get into a tight spot. Once you enter, the only way you can return to the real world is to beat the FM King, right? Right. If you don't, you'll never be able to return to the real world ever again. You came all the way here, but if you want to turn back, now's the time. Thanks, Mega. And I'm going forward. <laughs> I thought you'd say that. If you made up your mind, I won't say any more. Whenever you're ready, let's go. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. The monitors are blank. Fight. You can't pulse out now, kid. Can't save either. If you are ready for what lies ahead, continue on, and you shall find that which you seek. May your brethren be with you in spirit as you face it alone. Waves are really strong here. That means the FM King is nearby. You die in the game, you die in real life, pretty much. Omegasis. While well, you are in that lowly body, you are of no threat to me. I grant you special permission to ascend those stairs and come before me. Now come. <laughs> Even if you haven't invited me, I would have gone up there anyway. Come on, Geo, let's go. Yeah. Well done, Mega Man, Omegasis. So the enemy who appears before me is one of my own warriors. Who would have thought it? So this is what it is meant by biting the hand that feeds you. Yeah, okay, you're not seeing this face again. No Aemian warrior was able to reach me. However, one of my own was. I do commend you. Your Majesty, stop the attack on Earth. Wyatt, I will destroy all planets that wish harm upon my own. Harm? I think you misunderstood. My dad came all the way out here just to form a brother band with Planet FM. Be quiet, you. Brother band indeed. Hmm. Your real purpose was invasion. You won't trick me. Hmm. Hopeless. This isn't the first time that King's paranoia has got the better of him. Geo, there's only one way to stop him. You have one way to stop me. What are you talking about? You have no way of stopping me. We won't know unless we try. Hey, Kingy, you were saying earlier that no way Emian had made it to you before, so... Well, I guess that makes me the first. You're an Aemian survivor? What? You're a survivor of Planet AM? Geo, remember how you said that I've never lost anyone before? Well, I didn't say it then, but everything that was precious to me was stolen by that guy. That's why I could say that. I understand how you feel. Mega... If I don't do anything, then Earth's just gonna end up like my home planet. Planet AM. That's why we have to stop him now. Yeah. <coughs> Sorry, my throat's a little hurt. scratchy. <laughs> what can one am and an Earthling boy possibly do? If you think you could stop me, then by all means, go ahead and try. Awaken from your slumber, Andromeda. He's not getting his hands dirty. This thing will, though. Yeah, like AM and FM radio, exactly. That's Andromeda? At its core, it's a ball of loneliness. It has an EM body, but all it does is ever so lonely and sadly eat other EM beings. Andromeda? Have some hors d'oeuvres before I serve up the main course. Earth. I will crush all those who oppose me. Mega, this is it. The last battle. Let's show that untrusting brat of a king the power of our bond. Last battle. Ride on. 
You regret standing against me. Andromeda, go! Why does this thing look like a crab on its side? It's it's a hand, really. I think it's supposed to be fingers. I can't remember how the, what the deal is with hurting this thing. I know it doesn't get hurt normally. Oh, it goes up and down. Okay, that's it. Can't damage it when it's down. I also don't know if the squares in the back still exist. They do. Okay. That's not going to be helpful now. 3D model looks pretty good, yeah. I'm al also, remember though, this isn't what it looked like on the DS. I have this up res to four times native resolution. The files looked good, but you wouldn't see it in this high quality on the actual system. a lot of health. Grass won't be good. Can you see where it's healthy? It's a number below it. Alright, we won.
Andromeda. I impossible! I refuse to accept that there is a power that can defeat Andromeda! Andromeda, arise and crush them! Sounds like this noise from Mist when you go through a book. Geo, it's coming in for another round! Can you still fight? Ugh. Ugh. Thud. <laughs> Looks like you have used all your Sorry, I slipped into my native A uh, Ephemian language there. Looks like you have used up all your strength. Finish them now, Andromeda. Geo, pull yourself together! Ugh. I can't. My body doesn't have any strength left. Arr, even if you're in waveform, you're still a human. You're not designed to take this much radiation. Is there no way for you to withstand the FM King's EM waves? Curses! Concede, Mega Man. <coughs> Stop, Andromeda! Ugh. Help! Andromeda's going nuts. We better do something or else. Ah, my body. It won't move. I'm sorry, everyone. You're not alone, Geo. So stand strong. Hang in there, Geo. I won't forgive you if you lose, Geo. I'm cheering for you with some beef power. We're counting on you, Geo. You can do it, Geo. So stand up. Everyone is behind you, Geo. Believe in the power of your friendships. Dad. Everyone. Oh, that's the meat, yeah. I can... I can feel your strength. What is this power? Everyone, lend me your strength! He straight up says it. He says the meme line. This is it! Uh... Andromeda. Truly is the power of friendship, but you see, there's still more. Why are you not finishing me off? You came here to exact your revenge, correct? Yeah, it's the only thing I thought about that could take away my pain. But I've given that up. <laughs> Being with Geo for so long has given me a new optimistic look on life. Besides, you don't have your underlings or Andromeda anymore, so you're pretty much powerless now. It is as you say. I have lost. But allow me to ask one thing. Where did you get the power to destroy Andromeda from? <laughs> Listen real good and remember. This is the power of relationships which the Earthlings hold so dear. The power of relationships. That's right. It's the power we give to one another when we really trust that person. The ability for both people to become stronger. That is the true power of our relationships. The more power you have you can trust... Oh, excuse me. The more people you have who you can trust, the bigger that power becomes. I can't trust anyone. Ever since I was born, people have tried to delete me to steal my throne. Fwend power. <laughs> my siblings, relatives, close associates. They devised all sorts of plans to erase me. Actually, I had a few close calls in my life. I would think I had faithful followers. But they would turn out to be the same as everyone else. If I can't trust the ones most loyal to me, how can I trust complete strangers? The only thing I trusted about strangers was that they were out to betray me. Everybody betray me. I thought that I shouldn't bother trusting others to begin with if they were going to betray me in the end. Not trusting others has made my whole life nothing but loneliness. I shouldn't bother trusting others to begin with if they'll just betray me in the end. I thought the exact same thing. To me, someone approaching with even a smile on their face was suspicious. Actually, Planet FM attacked Planet AM the year right after we proposed to become good friends. That was when Gemini appeared. He looked upon Planet AM with distrust, and reported that Planet AM was planning to attack us. 
Gemini, huh? The creep. <laughs> it was easy for him to manipulate a king who was already paranoid. Look, I came here to get revenge, not your life story. <laughs> and my dad contacted Planet FM, hoping to create a friendly bond, too. Yes. But enough of this. Come, finish me. I can't. Why not? My dad truly wanted Earth to be friends with Planet F FM. If I were to finish you off, I'd be betraying my dad and what he stands for. So I think I'll forgive you instead. I mean, you killed a whole planet of people, but whatever. You are forgiving me. The one who, who tried to destroy your planet. But in return, I have a request. A request? Actually, two. First, I want you to trust me. My dad always said that the reason people get into fights is because they don't know each other. If they knew each other better, then they could trust each other. I didn't know how you felt, but through this fight, I've learned a lot. I realize that nothing good can come out of loneliness. That only through relationships with others can anything good be born. Nothing good can come out of loneliness. Yes, I suppose that is true. And what is your other request? I hope you will be my friend. You and me? <laughs> you would be the first friend I've ever had. I think you need friends you can believe in. I have a lot of friends, and they are the ones who helped me get to where I am today. I'll be your very first friend. I've never had a murderer as a friend before. If you have people you can trust, then your cold, lonely world suddenly grows warmer. My world will change. Earthling, I can trust your words, correct? What are you doubting him for? He's got enough power to destroy Andromeda. He doesn't have any reason to trick you. Mega Man. No. I mean Earthling. Would you tell me your name? My name is Geo Stellar. Just Geo is fine, though, Your Majesty. My name is Cepheus, and you can call me that. Geo. Cepheus, we're friends from now on, you and I. So here's to us. Yes. Omegasis, are you alright with this? Huh? Are you sure you don't want your revenge? I was deceived by Gemini and destroyed Planet AM with Andromeda. So friendly, he never appears again. No, that's not true. He does appear in one cutscene. In, uh, in three. Don't be an idiot. You're Geo's friend, aren't you? If I hurt you, I'd be a real bad guy. Geo, Omegasis, thank you. I will return to Planet FM, and I promise to tell all of its citizens to treasure the strength of a trusting heart and to make amends for our sin of destroying Planet AM by rebuilding it. Cepheus, we will lend a hand in reviving Planet AM. Guess who? I can't be a murderer. All my closest friends are dead. Yeah. Wait. It's the satellite admins, and they're no longer shadowy. The three sages of Planet AM. Mega Man, you have fought well. Omegasis, as we had guessed, you are indeed one of us. You, the FM King, who has opened your heart. If you continue to have a trusting heart as Mega Man does, the power to revive Planet AM will appear. Not all the AMians are gone. A few are living on other planets as we have. If we were to call everyone back together, Planet AM could be brimming with life again. Pegasus, Dragon, Leo. But they are all gone? No, they're not. Maybe all the warriors are dead. I vow to never lose my trusting heart. Very well. Most of them are rip, yeah. Yep, the, the spoiler is that the satellite admins were AMians the whole time. Geo, Omegasis, farewell. Until we meet again. Omegasis, is this alright? Yeah, I'll take a pass. If I don't stick around, Geo will never get home. Plus, I finally got used to Earth, so I'm gonna stick around for a bit. It's the embodiment of the mods, yeah. <laughs> we expected that much of you. Take care of yourself, Cepheus. They can ban him or anyone at any time. You too, Geo. No, that wasn't the right voice. It is time. Then they immediately turned on each other and murdered everyone. Did I do what's right? You just saved Earth. I don't think anyone's got anything to complain about. Come on, let's get ourselves home to Earth. Okay. Okay. My brother band's leveled up. Oh, I can't actually... Yeah, you can't save right now. I can't 
can't pulse in. Come on, let's get out of here, or we won't be able to get back to Earth. Everyone died, the end, yep. Alright, all we gotta do is walk in here and we're fine. Right? <coughs> Hurry, Geo! The station's beginning to fall apart! I know. EM wave change. Geo stellar. Ah! Oh, the wave hole is. I can't go back to Earth now. What now? Oh, this is a jam. Over here, Geo. What is it? I heard my dad's voice just now. I said to go over here. Switch. I think I could disconnect this module. Only could literally pulse in at any time, yeah. Maybe we could get back to Earth, Mega. Beautiful thing about relationships, you can't seem to always be there. Oh, well, well, just wait. Story's not over yet. Um, but how do you know how to fly this thing? My dad showed me the space station's control panel once a long time ago. And since I'm a baby genius, I just happen to remember it. So I think I can. Closing hatch. Could be radiation poisoning, Geo. Now launching the emergency escape module. Hmm? We're picking up a signal. Is... You know, the re This is Boreal. Please respond. Mr. Boreal. The wave hole's gone, but we could still get transmissions, it seems. This is Geo. The Earth is okay. Yeah, they don't explain how the fuck Geo is even still alive despite all the radiation. Oh, it's probably because Omega is protecting him. We're returning to Earth in the emergency module. Over. This is Aaron. Thank you. You did great. Geo has a photographic memory when he feels like it. Ah, hold on, you. Geo. Thank goodness you're okay. Hurry home. Ah. Test, test. This is Luna. Great job, Geo. Now hurry straight back. Hey, Geo. You really are my hero. After you get back, we're gonna go for burgers. <laughs> Geo, thank you. Hold on, you guys. Give me some space. Haha. <laughs> space joke. Geo, are you okay with the controls? Yeah, I sort of know how to fly this. Right now it's on autopilot, so we're moving at a good pace towards Earth. I see. Phew. That's a relief. Hell yeah, bungers. Did I tell you I got a bunger plush? I posted about it on Twitter, but I don't know if I ever mentioned it on stream. Fan gamer restocked their bunger plushes, so I have one. Ah! System error. System error. Deviating from set course. Deviating from set course. Geo! Ah! Uh. Geo. Geo! And thus, he was never heard from again. What's a bunger? Uh, a bunger is is a burger, but with googly eyes, and it says its name constantly. That's did, did I not put that on my soundboard? Oh my god, I don't think I have that noise actually. It's a good thing uh you brought uh, we brought that up now actually because I'm gonna open this and uh, fill out the temp with some more. Oh, I have it on the temp thing. Okay, I'm also gonna put uh, Malaysian Vegeta because I keep forgetting I want that clip on there. That's not what I meant to hit. What the hell just happened? No. Okay. Ooh. You're finally awake. You're finally awake. What? happened. A system error occurred and the module's been thrown off course. You were knocked unconscious by the shockwave. We're in a bit of a serious problem now. Good morning, Chrono. <laughs> problem? Yeah, the autopilot system's busted and we've deviated for, from a course for Earth. Right now we're just floating through space. I don't think we could get back to Earth. 
What? I don't think we have zero chance, but I'm not sure which way Earth is from here. No. What is that? What, Malaysian Vegeta? I played that, um, I played that on, uh, the other stream. It's, it's a clip of Mal Malaysian dub, Malaysian English Vegeta. And it's, uh, it's quite something. They refer to it as the Speedy Dub. Kakaroto is mine. Nobody touches him. Not even you. Ah! What, Geo 20XX? What the fuck, yeah? Well, because Malaysian dubs... It's very interesting, because a lot of English voice actors will do modern Malaysian dubs that won't be the same as, as American English dubs. But I do believe that they, um, they're, they're starting to do less of that now. They're starting to get more... Just hit a button on my keyboard. It's starting to get more local talent for it. Thankfully, local talent, that's a little better than, uh, than that clip. That's from Android 13 movie. That's Android 13. When you hear that noise at the end, that's Android 13 breaking Vegeta's back over his knee. Uh, I didn't stop recording there, did I? Good. Meanwhile, on Earth... Yes, we got to Vista Point. The module Geo is riding and has drastically deviated from its course. We have no way to find it from here. But because you are brothers, if you send out a signal... Geo might receive it out in space. But I didn't become a brother with him yet. Do you think I can still reach him? A brother band is something that connects two people's hearts, no matter where they are. If your wish is to find him is strong enough, I'm sure it'll reach Geo. All right now. Everyone lift your transfer to the sky. Yep, that's right, we're doing this. Please, I hope this finds Geo. And I told him to come straight home. Hurry and come back to us. Geo, come back! Please, Geo, come back safe and sound. We're waiting for you, Geo. Her transfer's on a guitar, which is pretty sick, yeah. Well, I'm assuming because that's where Lyra is, and Lyra can enhance, uh... stuff. Dad, I don't think I'll ever see the Earth again. Don't give up, Geo. You still have a strong you still have strong bonds to the Earth. Bonds that, no matter how far apart you are, can't be cut. Geo, believe in your brothers. And never give up. I'll always be watching over you. Dad, wait. Dad. Dad. <clears throat> It was a dream. Yo, morning. How do we... There's no morning here. We're in space. I saw my dad in my dream. He told me not to give up. That I have strong bonds to the earth. And to believe in my brothers. Sounds like Kelvin. You never know. Maybe he really did come by. What's my transfer doing? This light. Ah! Is that what I think it is? It's the brother band. They were looking for me. Looks like they were really trying, too. Dad. Now I see why you value the bonds between people so much. No matter how far apart we are, no one can erase the power of this bond. Dad, I think I could be strong and move on. <clears throat> because I'm not alone now. And I have you, wherever you are. Let's go home to everyone. Yeah! 
So I was like, you know, when this when this series got announced, I was a little sour on it just because I felt like nothing can top Battle Network. And I won't say that this tops it, but story-wise, this is really good. It's a lot more... There's a lot more seriousness to it. A lot more a lot more depth to the characters, even though they're still pretty, you know, one-dimensional overall. Geo himself is a very interesting character because he spends half the game being a mopey protagonist but then genuinely has character development, which sticks to the series. You'll see in the uh, in the next two games that he is much more cheery. And it's cool, too, because a, a lot of the plot points in this game that don't get resolved do come up again in the future, but I won't spoil that now. But yeah, it's good. You have all the bosses in the background. Natsume worked on the European localization for this game. That's interesting. Eight hours, seven minutes, 133 standard, 12 mega, 6 giga. Which again, a lot of chips added to this patch, so this is way more than you would usually have of any of these at this point. Except standard, I guess. Three weeks have passed. Thanks to everyone, I was able to make it back to Earth, safe and sound. But the wounds I got during that rough flight made me miss school for a while. But I got the okay from my doctor, so today I get to go back. I'm kinda anxious and excited to see everyone again after so long. Geo, hurry up and come downstairs. Everyone's here waiting for you. Okay. Usually takes you 30, H 30 hours to finish most RPG-like games, yeah. Welcome back, GL. We figured it would be kind of sad if you had to go to school by yourself after so long, so we decided to drop by. So you'd better show us some appreciation. By the way... What are you doing here? You don't go to Echo Elementary. Aren't you supposed to go to your school? Well, today's Geo's first day back, so it's a special day. No harm done, right? I'll go to my school right after this. Besides, I could get there in no time if I take the wave road. Special day, huh? <laughs> I guess so. Yeah. You did real good with that tiny body of yours, Geo. You really are amazing. Um, I heard that if you go into space, you could get taller. But you don't look like you grew any. Welcome back. I'm relieved to see you're okay. Thank you, everyone. If you guys weren't there for me. <laughs> I I wouldn't be here right now. What are you crying about? You're the hero that saved Earth. Pull yourself together. That's right. You should feel proud. Okay. Now that's what we like to see. A real manly expression. Ah! There's the bell. If we don't hurry, we'll be late. As the class president, I can't be late. 
Come on, everyone. Let's move. Mr. Boreal, Mr. Copper, thank you so much. Geo, we're going to be late. You don't even go to our school. Geo, hurry up. Okay, I'm coming. Well, bye, Mom. Pokemon Silver was like 33 hours for you, and I'm not sure if I did any of the side stuff. Uh, how long did Pokemon Silver take me to beat? See you later. Well, it depends on where you consider it beaten. Is it credits or beating Mount Silver? Gio has really grown and changed. He's like a different person. There's still all sorts of things I'd like to ask, but I guess this isn't the time for it. She doesn't even go here. Calvin, are you seeing this? He has so many friends now. And he smiles just like you. <laughs> credits, oh, okay. That's a long time to get to the credits. I was gonna say, if you're doing all 16 badges, I could see that. So, what are you going to do now? What do you mean? We are aliens who live inside the hearts of lonely humans. But Geo and Sonya aren't lonely anymore. <clears throat> I'm gonna do what I want to do. I've got the feeling that there'll be more excitement down the line, if I stick with him. Plus, I want to learn more about Earth. What a coincidence, I was thinking the exact same thing. Shall we get going? We're going to be left behind if we don't. So the weird thing is... Yeah, let's go! The end. So the weird thing is, um, even though they all just had that meeting there, Bob Copper and Hope Seller do n still do not know that Geo is Mega Man. For some reason, somehow, I think Aaron, I think Aaron, like, coordinated a lie with them to, like, with the rest of the kids that they didn't know. Because all the kids know, but, uh, Geo's mom and Bob Copper do not know. And I say that because that does come up in the later games. New pre-made face picks have been added. Save clear data. Yeah, hell yeah. Save complete. So there is post-game. Uh, there's not a ton of it in this game, but there's enough. Crush the ultimate weapon, Andromeda. So this game has clear stars, just like, um... Just like, uh... Battle Network. You get a bunch of them. I don't know how many we'll be going for. Okay, so it took us back here. Uh, it did level us up. Again, you can see our HP is even higher. So it did save. Everyone's level 35. In your usual spot again, kid. So the game does give you hints, I believe, in this patch as to what to do in a post-game. There's one dungeon. Every post-game in this game has one unique dungeon. He has a quest now. And Geo, be careful. Okay, today I'll show Geo that thing. <laughs> I know he'll be surprised. Should I go over there? Out of the post-game dungeons kind of hope you beat in every po SP boss, including the new one. Yeah, there is, a, there is a new boss added to the game, and I don't know what it is yet. I'll tell you the truth, Geo. I meant to bring you something today. I haven't been able to find it. It's an old photo album with some pictures I wanted you to see. I bet I stashed it somewhere in my lab. I really wanted you to have a look at it. I'll be waiting, so you better come back. Oh, Sonya has a thing, too. There's 
someone I've been- oh, I didn't see what that was. I can't see it right now. Practice your singing voice, huh, kid? There's a song I've been trying to write, but I can't just seem to find the right words. I just feel so uninspired. Looks like Sonya's in a bind. I don't know the slightest thing about songwriting. Just go talk to her, isn't that what brothers do? Hmm, should I go talk to her? Okay, I'll see what I can do. Alright, get ready for a lot of... Uh, ...ZR holding down, which is my speed up button. Oh, Geo, uh... Why am I moping around? Well, actually, I'm trying to come up with new lyrics for a new song, but I just keep seeming to run into a brick wall. I know, why don't you help me write? You might be able to give me a little bit of inspiration. Please? Really? Great, let's get started. The title is Bonds. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. These men are pawns. I'm all alone in the still of night. I open my window and look outside, and there it is, that soft... Moonlight. Twinkling in the night sky, I can see... Oops. That doesn't really sound right. Stars. And I ask them if they are... Lonely. They answer back to me. They say they're... Connected. Many stars shining strong, all thanks to their... Bonds. Together they are never... Alone. Tiny pieces of starlight shine together. That's how you'll become even... Brighter. Human beings like me and you can combine our strength and get stronger too. Wavy too. I gotta say, chicky chicky baby, make me go boom kaboom. We're not here to drink our mother's milk. That's what Sundown does, apparently. If we remember, uh, if we remember Live Alive, he and uh, he and that guy in Battle Network Two have something in common. The best way to strive for perfection is to look around you and find your bonds. No, I'm not alone. La la la. Yes, we did it! We finished the song together. Become Ruffles. Thank you. It's all because of you, Geo. This is a thank you from me. Debut album. The song I wrote with you, Geo, is gonna be a truly unforgettable song. Oh boy, I can't wait to see what stupid item this gives me. An album full of songs performed by Sonya. This is written on a leaflet inside the case. Dwolf, Dwolfs. And this was my poem for Manchester United. <laughs> Duo Wolves. Duo Wolves. Oh, whoa. It's rever- There's no- There's no whoa in there. D-W-O-O Wolves. Cloaker? Come on. Alright, I mean, I guess that was a piss-easy quest. Oh, right. There's a new boss now. There he is. Geo, this guy's emitting some strange waves. Y you mean he's an enemy? You. What do you think you are? Uh, do you dare defy my royal crown? What? Defy? I am Coron XIV, master of the George Vaughan family. I is that so? Anyways, what's that sticking out of your back? Oh, this is an arrow. Uh, an arrow? Doesn't that hurt? Huh. Of course not, I'm already dead. Really? You could say I'm a ghost. I I don't believe it. Never mind that, do you have the ability to wave change? Uh, yeah, I guess. But what does that have to do with anything? I once was a normal human until an alien, a ghost alien of all things, came and took over my body. You mean an FMian? That's right. Hear me, young man. I must preserve the George of Vaughan name by waging battle. Yet, as this is a peaceful land, I am quite battle-starved. I want you to fight me. But what if I don't want to? Silence. I will not tolerate insolence. I shall wait for you in the city dump wave road. Yep. So we literally have a ghost. A ghost EM wave. though. He's here somewhere. Okay, 
there he is. You there, I, Coron the Fourteenth, master of the Georgia Vaughan family, desire to engage in spirited battle with you. Face me now. How dare you refuse an offer from me? So this is the third of the three optional uh, bosses in this game. Get ready, Geo. Crown Thunder. Got a bird on his head. But yeah, his version one has 2,000 HP. Ghost and an alien, aren't we mixing genres? I guess. If aliens have souls, why can't they be ghosts? Green Dragon is actually good because he's electric element. Thunder. I must say, your skills are praiseworthy. You there, have you come to do with me, Corona the Fourteenth, Master of the Georgia Vone family? Let's do this, Geo! Crown Thunder EX. Sans under God damn it. I wasn't even thinking about that, but now that you said it, the fucking joke's gonna be in my mind.
grass field would have been nice. You guys are posting a lot of faces in chat. Actually got crowned under EX. That was a magnificent move. Nice. 380. Ursula V2 Tove Radar Missile 2. Decent. Face pick. Uh, what can we pick that are pre-made here? Let's see, we got the generic characters. Uh, special ones: Hope, Kelvin, Aaron, uh, Mister D whatever his name is, uh, Pat, Cepheus, Mega Man, Pegasus, Mega Man, Leo, Mega Man, Dragon, Mega Man, Spacesuit, Geo. Uh, some of these are multiple colors too. Pre-made. Again, this is for multiplayer. This doesn't mean anything. You can also draw your own uh, face icon. Right, let's continue on. I'm not going to bother doing the SP bosses on stream just because it's not worth it. I'm actually going to look up what I need to do to unlock everything in the post game and probably do it off stream and then come back to this and finish it up. Um, because of that, I may not stream this tomorrow. I may, I may move on to something else. Which, honestly, we're going to have an art stream? Uh, not me, but maybe. Speaking of, my stream anniversary is next Monday, and I do have the day off, so I'm thinking about streaming like a lot earlier than normal, and doing like a long stream. But I don't know what to—I don't know what to do. I was like thinking, oh, maybe it's a good chance to do my first subathon, but like no one's gonna come. No one's gonna come here to do that. I want to play TKO from Jackbox. That was fun when you played. I wouldn't mind doing that. I don't have any Jackbox games on Switch, and I wouldn't mind downloading a few. Um. But I'll have to see. Do it, do it, do it. Art stream. Well, I can't do an art stream. Where am I going? Uh, Amakin first and foremost. I'm looking at everyone. This one's new. I can't believe space invaders are headed here. But if it's true, then I need to step it up. Come on, step it up. for any missing side quests or anything. We're good, we're good. I'll link your stream everywhere if I have to to make a TKO stream work. I mean, I greatly appreciate that. Maybe we will do that. Here's my usual tradition for, for yearly streams. I'll go over what I streamed in the last year. And then I'll stream a mana game. But at this point, I only have two mana games left that I haven't played yet. The real-time strategy on DS. And then Seiken and Setsu 4, which I don't know how I'm going to get that working because it's a PS2 game. But I do want to do those two at some point. Finish up the series. Then what I would likely do is I'll do another run of Trials of Mana with the last story I didn't do. And then, uh... Close it out with, um, if I really have to, uh, 
Secret of Mana remake. Ugh. Secret of Mana was not- I didn't enjoy too much, and Secret of Mana remake is not very good. Something fell and won the locker. Geo got album. I had a feeling that was gonna be it. Mr. Boyle's photo album. Okay, so I actually have to bring that back to him, unfortunately. Let's go to the park again after I get better. Oh, he's got a, a quest. Shit. Why is there only one wave hole in this area? Here's the thing, I want to do a long stream, so I don't know if just doing Jackbox games is viable, but, uh, we'll see. The other thing is that I probably have to take a break, so it may not be the full stream, it may be, like, the first half. But I don't know. Again, it would be much earlier, because it's on Labor Day, which I have off. Subcard, Resurrective. Uh, who would that get sent to? For use with the Lunar Knights, fully revised an ally. I guess I'd send that to, uh, Lucian. Oh. Also, I love how I got the same sub- I got the sub item from the same mystery data twice. Lucian's level has increased to 40. Here's something in return. See ya. Mega Man got a sub card. Sun Key! Oh, nice. That can let me open one of the red datas. Item that auto unlocks red mystery rate waves. Maybe like to, I don't know, draw something with chat or something. Well, I mean, that's what TKO would be. It would be an art game with stream. Everyone would use their phones to draw. Or I think they could use desktop too, if they're using their browser. Last begun. Not familiar with it at all. The way it works is that the host will play the game. They'll stream it. It's really meant to be played locally, but you can stream it. If it, if it works better. If, if you want to play with people online. And what happens is you watch the game on your phone. Or on, the, on stream. And then you p participate either with the website. Or you use your phone. And it's still the website, it's all browser-based. Sometimes pet memories from the past come flooding back to me all at once. That kid looks troubled. Do you want to help him? Okay, let's get on it. Better write myself a memo mail. Fibbage gets funny too. Wound up inputting the same answer as the host multiple times. HP memories are there. There must be quite a few if um, I'm only level 78. Huh? What am I thinking about? Oh, nothing really. Just that sort of bot that found me. I wonder where he's at and what he's doing now. It's been more than 10 years now. I wonder if he's still working at the city dump. Literal trash baby. You have all the side quests done, you're in, like, level 81. No idea what the HP cap is. Well, I mean, I imagine it's a thousand without any buffs. I haven't fought Wolfwood ZX yet, either. A ten-year-old Sorter bot. It's probably scrapped by now. Uh, hold on. I think there was one special one. It was always finding something unusual. Strangest of all was when it found a person. And that got it some attention, and soon after, I believe it was bought by a department store. Alright, well. I may have a reason to go to Times Square again. There, I gotta go all 
way back down here. Be -ding. Oh, you found the photo album. Geo gave album Mr. Boreal. And this takes me way back. This is to thank you. Geo got an HP memory, nice. Well, there's level 80. Ah, yes, there's the photo I wanted you to see. This is Kelvin when he was young. And above that is you when you were just a tot. At that time, your dad said, I'm going to make a wonderful and delightful future for my son. That's my job. I wanted to pass those words from your father on to you, as you live and grow into the future. And Geo, be careful. I'm gonna go back up there and use the sun key. There are two red mystery datas, one of which is in the last area. I'm gonna get that one first. Sun key. You want to use a sun key. Use subcard sun key to unlock the wave. Mega Man got Tove V2. Nice. Perennial rain rocks on far nine panels. This this chip is gone. It's, it's outlived its usefulness. I had that. I could have replaced that a while ago. Second to last row center X lightning attack. So it's like it hits like a, an X at the right back. Second to last row center, yeah. You mainly remove moves before going into battle or is it shuffled? Wait, what? Remove moves? Oh, you mean my... Ch I, I don't... It's... The, the cards are always shuffled. It'll pick six random ones from your deck. everything here. Let's go to Times Square now. Check Domican out. We checked here out. A large amount of Z-Waves are approaching. How are we supposed to face this enemy? Anything else out here? No, what will happen to the Earth? Okay, Bob Copper's the only one with a new quest. Investigation notes. High Z-Wave levels confirmed in the vicinity. However, no other actionable clues have been found. An immediate investigation is necessary. Check this out. It's worth taking a look. I can write a memo mail to myself. Hey, Geo. I picked up strange waves just now. It's coming from someplace nearby. There have been three anomalies, and I've got something to do something about them before anything happens. Anomalies. It's a doggo statue, yep. I'm guessing they're in the three terminals.
again, you know, post game, we don't we don't need to we don't need to sit through everything here. We need to sit through it when we're playing the main game. Yep. <laughs> Something's fishy about that guy. But he's the origin of the suspicious waves. Alright, Geo, get ready! for the others. Oh, right there. It's the same dialogue. It's a ton of Moais. Wild 3 slash sword attack. Just got star frags and nothing else. Is brother six your brother? But how many brother bonds I have? You can only have six in this game. In later games, it's limited to six real life brothers, as in like people you add on your friends list, and then a bunch and in games wouldn't take up space. But this game actually makes you juggle in-game and real brothers, so it's actually uh, a bit more, um... Requires a bit more finesse because of that. louder humming noise than usual, and I'm not I'm a little worried about that. That's all of them. Let's report back to that copper guy. Professor Coppertone. Oh, it stopped. Maybe it wasn't my computer. What? The waves have been taken care of. You're right. The strange waves are gone. Are you saying you got rid of them, Geo? No. It's just my imagination. Hmm. Well, anyway, thanks for the report, kid. Take this. HP memory. Nice. Sure you didn't do anything to it? Okay, I need to get in there to do the uh, thing with the lonely fragment. I wonder if Luna's alright. a sorter bot. It looks pretty old, but has lots of scratches. What's a sorter bot doing here? Better let Pat know. Maybe a Geo's lurking in my PC. Maybe. We ain't fighting, we're out of here.
Huh? The lonely heart is responding to the mirror. Some kind of data is being sent to my transfer. Should I accept the transmission? Register where? Oh, wait a minute. Wants to leave a brother, brother's gun until we registered. Really delete? Geo Stellar is now your brother. Wait, it's myself? Wait, I formed a brother band with myself? I'm not sure what just happened, but... Well, you, they say you know yourself better than anyone, right? This could be pretty useful. I assume you don't need me to tell your own link ability, do you? It seems like this brother is a copy of your current data. So if you want to update it, come back to the mirror and check it again. Oh, wow. It's Taylor Ham, not Pork Roll. HP plus 120, gauge plus 1. So now I got fast gauge, nice. That's better than uh, the Lunar Knights brother I had there. And now that means I get that gauge plus one even if I change satellites. Basically, the idea is here you can get brother bands from other players without other players, yeah. You could do it infinitely, I figured. Okay, cool. Well, that's, that's neat. It's like six copies of yourself is possible, wow. But you can update it with new stats and stuff, which is neat. What am I doing? Oh, I got the copy box. I'm gonna stop soon, but uh, before I do anything, before I do that, take a look around here. Nothing I haven't gotten already, right? Yeah, yeah. Sweet, nice lesson. Love yourself, yeah. All right, I didn't fight Wolfwood's EX yet. I'm gonna do that now while I'm here. Again, see if you could calm me down. He's wood, so fire will do extra damage to him. Yep, we're all wooing. Have you played this series of Mega Man? Yeah, I've played it fully. I've played all three games in it. my excitement for now. So I think I fought the version EX of every boss at this point. Definitely fought all the EF, the EF, the main ones on the roads. Did I fight Lever Skells? Yes, I did. I did fight Cygnus. I did fight Taurus. I fought all the optional bosses. Okay, so we've done the optionals for all of them. Now I can fight the SP versions of all of them, which give me the SP chip. Alright, we're going back to Amakin. I think we've kind of done everything now, in all, all the areas aside from, uh... Echo Ridge.
Oh, you found where the sorter bot is? At Times Square department store. So that's what happened to him. Thank you, Geo. Please take this as a token of my appreciation. HP memory, nice. I'll go and see him soon. Let's go to the park again after I get better. anything left to, like access in any of these areas. Alright, let's do a sweep of this area real quick. Nothing new, nothing new, nothing new. Nothing new. something new. Shit. I'll have to come back to him in a second. Nothing new. Ooh, there's gold mystery data. I need it. Nothing new there. 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 Okay. off. Alright, thank you for stopping by, Gem. I'm gonna stop in a few minutes, probably. It's getting, uh, pretty late. Mega Man got Recov 120 star. Eh, that was kind of a lame. I'm not gonna be using that. Lame fuck. Uh... Thank you, you enjoy your day as well. I figured Hope would have one. Oh dear, the fridge is acting funny. If I don't get it fixed, all the food inside will go bad. Times like this, I wish you were here, Geo. Let's go and help your mom. The fridge? Oh, that's right. It's been acting really funny. I wonder what could be the matter. wave is like a state of mind that splashes your feelings to create like the total non-bummer. Feel free to parlay with me anytime about the big wave. Cowabunga, dude! I don't have a clue in the heck this guy's talking about. He wants to make a big splash or something like that. Should I pay him a visit? Aw, oh, man, I know it's gonna be a drag. Fuck. Viruses. So that's why the fridge was acting funny. Okay, let's do it. Easy. That should do the trip. I 
trip. That should do the trick, I hope. Oh, the fridge is fixed? That's wonderful. Thank you, Geo. Geo got Protect Charm. Hope you're hungry for dinner tonight. Protect Charm. Uh, a Protection Charm. There's something written on the words. On, there's something written on the back. Also great. Also great. Heavy cannon. Ugh. Crap reward. Hello, I'm Lisbeth. Oh, one of the other, uh... One of the other, uh, Terennials. Oh no, that's not the Terennial, that's um... That's the girl that owns the shop, I think. That's interesting. I'm Lisbeth, come visit my shop sometime, okay? Yep. Mark II. Welcome, this is the transfer of Mr. Famous Mark II. But my brothers can call me Mark II. My passion is, raised, is to raise promising young net battlers. Oh, I, th I actually think I did go in there before. I remember reading that, but whatever. Maybe I was uh, mistaken. Zoop. Aloha. Hey, listen up. You may not be able to tell, but I'm a surfer. Yeah, I look like a surfer to you? Well, maybe just a little. <laughs> I love riding waves more than anything. Even the cards I collect are the ones that make waves. But there's one card I really haven't been able to get my hands on, and that's the Wide Wave 3 card. I wonder if there's any way I could get one. I mean, even stores are having a hard time getting them. Oh, I have to ditch Wide Wave 3 out of my own deck to get that. Oh well, we hardly knew ye. Great aqua cards, don't worry. I mean, I could just get more, it's fine. That card, is that? It is! Wide Wave 3! Please say you're gonna give it to me. Oh, dude, thanks. Here, let me give you this. An HP, ma'am. Now every day is gonna be summer for me. Thanks. Dude, how the heck did you come back here anyway? Level 84. I'm assuming if there's a shop that sells three more HP memory plus tens, that'll be another six levels, and that'll get me a level 90. Okay, that's everything there. Sweep the school real quick. No, 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 nothing. Whatever it is, bring on, bring it on. I can use my footwork and dodge it. UGM wave approaching. Not even this curtain can protect me now. Is 
theory is freaking huge. Oh, this girl's a quest. We'll be fine as long as we stay here. Tutor, or it's called. Something's wrong with the temperature control system in my classroom. I don't want my darling students to, to catch cold. Somebody please to do something. This tutor's in a jam. Could be the work of Ephemians. Should we do something? Okay, let's do this. Huh? Why do I look troubled? Wow, you really know how a lady's feeling. Well, it's this classroom. It's so cold in here. I don't want my lovely students to catch colds. Do you think there's going to be something wrong with the temperature control? Oh, only one way to find out. Whoosh! Having cooling problem? Whoosh! I know that voice. It's Thermo Man. Your timing is impeccable. Can you, some can you use that car to do something about the temperature in here? Oh, please help me. Thermo card. Card in. Thermo Man is in the house. So what'll it be? Hotter or colder? Heat. Whoop! It's a tad nippy in here, isn't it? Let's crank up the heat. Sizzling! Wow, it's getting warmer in here. Hope that's just right for you, madam. It is. Thank you so much. Here's a little something for you. Ice Meteor 2. Really? Now the kids won't catch a cold. I should feel at ease now that the lullaby has stopped. Really? Okay, okay, I believe you. Here's a small thank you gift. Power song. Now I can concentrate on my studies. Maybe. Alright, I never turned that quest in, apparently. Did I miss any others? No. Damn it. <laughs> oh, fuck. I have two kids with quests now. Kids with quests. Kids with quests. And then I know all the kid. I know all my friends at Vista Point are gonna have quests as well. Strike Edge. I think I have that already. Just Zack, I think. Uh, Strike Edge and Bombalizer. I have both of those, I, I believe, in, uh... In, uh... Ugh, I feel like crap. I've been streaming too long. Without a break, at least. Don't I? I do have Strike Edge, I know that. I could have swore I had Bombalizer. Oh, 
My Bombalizer's a, a Giga card, that's why. No, it's Break Time Bomb, never mind. Yeah, I do. I have a Bombalizer. On to SF2 in the future? Yes, next year for its anniversary. I will do, uh, Star Force 2. <clears throat> Absolutely. It's not that I'm a dirty person, but I'm really bad at cleaning. No matter how hard I try, this room won't get clean. Cleaning, huh? Should I give her a hand? What a drag. Let's get this over with. Gotta write myself a memo mail. out. Need to, uh, do more. Hooey, 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 hooey. Hello, everyone. I'm Echo Ridge's Elementary's favorite DJ. Hello, everyone. Recently, there's been a lot of interference in our broadcast signal. Anyone who notices something suspicious should notify the school radio station right away. I bet it's the work of the Nephemian. Probably right. Do you think we should do something? Let's go get. Let's go. Let's go get unruly. Yeah, okay. I'm in charge of cleaning today. I never really was good at cleaning, and the teacher's gonna get mad at me. Can someone show me how it's done? Maybe a Navi that's good at cleaning can give you some pointers. Alright. Let's pull them out. Shit. Ba -ba 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 -bam! Having a bit of cleaning trouble, are you? Hey, what's that? A Shovel Man card? You've got some unusual cards. But your timing couldn't be better. Listen up, I'm going to give you some advice. But first, let me look this room over. Hmm. You cleaned this crass... You cleaned this classroom, didn't you? I see. I can tell right away that your cleaning style is pretty bad. Well, what do you mean? The corners are filthy, and they make all the difference. You do well to remember that. Bam, ba 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 bam. Hmm. Now I understand. Thank you. That was very educational. Please take this. Green burst. Nice. Okay, let's get cleaning. That was pointless. What, you're going to help me with the school broadcast? That'd be nice. Actually, lately there's been a lot of interference. I'd like to you to find out where it's coming from. I have something to do with the waves in this room. EM wave ball. That's got to be the source of the noise in the broadcast. Let's smash it! Rocky G's. Nice. Bazook one star. There's at least one more EM wave ball out there. Still gotta find it. Big crab.
least one more. Oh, come on. There it is. Alright, we're out of here. Inkies. Beautifully done. Green ink star. Okay, that's all of them. Let's go at the studio guy now. Plus 10 attack to confuse enemy. Okay. Found out where the interference was coming from. Good work. This is for a job well done. Why don't you join the broadcasting club? Now for some music to be annihilated to. Yeah, it's another plat. Oh, the rewards for these are so terrible. <laughs> All right. Well, that covers the entire school. So now that just leaves Thacker Ridge Park. Nope, all of them have quests. You better come back. I believe in you. We're not gonna do them now, I'm gonna stop. But, um, before I do... Geo, wait. I can feel the presence of an immensely strong being somewhere in the area. Don't tell me. An Ephemian? This wave is unlike anything I've ever felt. Whether it's friend or foe, I'm not sure. Anyway, just be careful, kid. And there's something else in this area, too. Something which wasn't here before. So we better take a look around. So you'll notice now there's a new portal here that looks like a wave road. And when you step in it... Couldn't see the quest icons in their transfers. <laughs> what is this place? We're in space. Welcome, Chosen Ones. Overcome the obstacles one by one. If you clear them all, I shall bestow a fragment of my power upon you. Come, you who are the Chosen Ones. Who is that? And what do they mean by overcome the obstacles? <laughs> no idea there. But if they're testing us, we'll make it. Let's go for it, Geo. Roger. So this is the post-game area. It's deep space. <laughs> it's not often I get visitors up here. And what's this? You have a transfer on you. Well, you've come to the right jammer. If you want, I could change what satellite your transfer's registered to. Normally, you can't change a transfer satellite after you've registered it, but I know a few tricks. Look, I'll even cut you a nice deal. It's not every day I get to do business here. What do you say? You want to change your transfer satellite? It'll cost you a thousand zenny. Don't want this change? That's fine, too. Let's do it. Great, which satellite will it be? Oh, uh, let's go Dragon. Actually, no, let's go Leo. Just because the fire ability is really good. Leo it is, then. Give me that transfer for a sec. Done. Enjoy your new life as a Leo. Come back anytime you want your satellite changed. Wow, it turned red. Barrier 200. Okay, we're not gonna get into this because this is- Oh god, this all looks so different. We're not gonna get into this because this is the post-game area. I just wanted to get in there. Hey guys, I I'm a Leo now. Uh, okay, yeah, I changed my, my changed my zodiac. Fuck you. I changed what day I was born. I'm gonna update my uh, data so I can. Yeah, yeah. Oh shh, shh, stop. Keep filling up that database. There we go. SF Leo, and I get my bonuses on. And I get a first barrier as well. Cool. Right. So now my car, my abilities for the card finder are 3, 3, and 5, which is pretty good. I get 5 and 5 with power ring, but I want to keep the uh, card finder on for now. Same. Same. 
Alright, so that's gonna be it for tonight. We did almost five and a half hours of stream, so I'm very satisfied. Uh, next time on Star Force, which might be the last Star Force stream, I will uh, do these last three quests, uh, do the hidden thing in this wave road, and then do the uh, the post game area, and hopefully finish it in one go. And uh, that'll be the end of Star Force. Nice, even ten streams. Hard save as well. There we go. Whew! Alright. I'm probably not going to do this tomorrow. Maybe I will. I don't know yet. We'll see. Uh, but otherwise, you know, hopefully this whole week we'll be doing streams and maybe I'll start early every day this week. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but yeah. Lots of stuff coming up. More of this. Digimon Survive. Possibly something else this Friday. I don't know yet. We'll see. But uh, yeah. Thank you for coming. If you want to check out more streams, check out twitch.tv slash team slash wildabandoned. Plenty of people streaming there right now. You can also stick around and my auto host might take you to someone. Who knows? Uh, you all have a great evening. Thank you for coming. My throat is really shot right now. Good night, and I'll see you tomorrow.